After another harrowing trip to the sewers where you attempted to map out its layout and determine what the exit actually looks like, you all return to your beds at the inn, except for Tammy and Chris, who decided to pay an early morning visit to Senchi, who had, unbeknownst to you all, a very stressful encounter with his former acquaintance, Freddy. We begin, uh, Sophie is sleeping next to Mal's and thanks to the odd timing of her new ring, has turned invisible. <laughs> to beat drops. Mm. What is this? <laughs> it's it's a good dreaming Starry Night style music, yeah. <laughs> it is yep. probably around four in the morning. Um, I just want to give Sophie the opportunity if she would like. This would, I guess, be noticeable to her. Like she's, I assume, staring at Senshi. Or, sorry, not Senshi. Mal's. I'm just trying to get into my Roll20 account now. It's not letting me. Oh, dear happens to the best of us. Okay, so um wait, so so does Sylphie notice she's invisible? Is she even awake? Yeah. I, I would give you that you're awake when this happens. Just because of the, the dramatic uh, event of you actually getting to cuddle mouths in your sleep. Or would you like the option to sleep but if you stay awake, you don't get the benefits of a long rest. Um, wait, so this is like morning? Sorry, this is morning or when does this specifically occur? Um, this would happen shortly after you got back from the sewers. So probably an hour in, so about four or five o'clock. Yeah, you stayed in one <laughs> five. So if she realizes she's invisible, she's just gonna stay perfectly still and think the universe is trying to ruin the moment. Okay. Um, then we will move along for now to Tammy and Chris, who are just sitting beside Senji. Would you guys like to do anything for the night, or? I think I was. I think Tammy was sleeping up in a tree or something, if I remember. Right. Okay. Where did they put her? And Chris, you were just sitting there. Yeah, I think I was just going to sleep here. Perfect. Perfect. So we will move along to the next morning. Um, Tammy and Chris, you guys slept in the courtyard, very close to like the barracks and stuff like that. So when the guardhouse wakes up around six in the morning, you're going to start to hear things. Just people moving around, clashing and banging, uh, and you're going to be jostled awake from wherever you are. The commotion of an oh. early town. Oh, what time is this? Too early. 6.30. Ah, oh, I just like roll over. <laughs> she just goes up higher in the tree and tries to put leaves on her head <laughs> like a pillow. <laughs> Doesn't work. <laughs> Perfect. So you guys can pretty much stay there as long as you uh, would like to. But it is rather noisy. Assuming Senshi is still out there and probably asleep himself. Yeah, you can see him. He has fallen asleep. It does seem to be a fitful one, maybe full of nightmares. You don't know. <laughs> when you look hey, at him, jostles. Hey, before, oh, never mind. No, no, sorry. I was. Before we go back, we should take shifts if in case any of us needs to shop later. And then she just flops back asleep. Yeah, I just. Without even moving, just do a thumbs up and then my arm <laughs> goes back down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and we're done. For now. It was beautiful. Uh, Mal's and Sylvie, you guys can sleep in for as long as you would like to. We're going to jump to you guys. Uh, I feel like if we, if we went to bed at like four, I think the best mouse could survive on is maybe like six hours of sleep. Sophie's not okay. moving till mouse does. Yeah, so I'd probably like my eyes would like flutter open probably when I'm like, yeah, 9 45, 10. Be like, uh. An early Wait. afternoon sun kind of slowly fades into your room. It's golden light. Beat drop, jeez. Okay, um. <laughs> Okay, taken aback by the shining light, my eyes are like, what? Uh, 
time is it? Do I see Sophie on top of me? No. <laughs> so I'm just like, okay, I go to like, I, I like pull my arms out. I'm like, what is on you, top There of is me? resistance. And I'm like rubbing on my your eyes. <laughs> and I'm like, and, and then I try to like sit up. So like, I guess strength, like, would it be a straight strength? I, I'm like, I push Sophie, against Sophie, yeah, like, Sophie, whenever Mal starts to move, what do you do? Stop trying to ruin my hold person spell. <laughs> Wait, what? I think do I hear this? Do I hear if this? She like... says it, yeah. I think. I'm like, Sophie! And I'm like, looking for her. Do I notice the invisible mass on me? The grip gets tighter. <laughs> I'm like, what? I would, I would attempt to break it thinking this is sorcery. What wizardry is this? And I would, I would try make to forcefully strength. break the grip. Okay, okay, make a strength check against Ooh. Sylphie's. Uh, Sylphie, oh, if you're no. just trying to power through holding on, then it's going to be strength as well. Yes! <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> this grip okay. easily breaks. You just hands fly off. No. Okay. Do you, do you maintain the invisibility? I, like, I don't... Well, actually, wait. I guess it was a wild magic, so I don't know if it's a thing like that. But, uh, so, I would, like, break the grip, and I would, like, try to roll out of the bed. And then, like, look back at the bed, like, in, like, almost like a defensive posture, but not like my weapons, just with my hands. So, I... wait, does, does the invisibility last? I was actually just looking at it, and it's only one minute. But you know what? I was essentially going to give it to you until you cast a spell. Oh, okay, okay. that's perfect then. <laughs> oh god, I'm going to be an invisible wrestling match. Or maybe a do an attack <laughs> one like, one <laughs> like an actual invisibility spell. I have to look that up now. Just out of nowhere, Miles the Heart's got something latched to his face. <laughs> like, ah! <laughs> what is this? You're ruining my whole <laughs> person spell. <laughs> My true power is finally awakened. Oh, Jesus. And she's just going to try to hold his hand. What? I can obviously hear her saying this, and I'm like, Sylphie, what is going on? And I'm like, I, I feel, I assume I feel the grasp for my hand, and I like just like jump back or attempt to. Okay, make she like a... attack against my AC? She'll make like a... A sleight of hand, and you can make like a dexterity to avoid it, or also a sleight of hand. I guess you're <laughs> battling hands, whichever you would like. If you want to jump back to a dex, uh, or yeah, and if the other one, do the same for me sleight of hand and dex. So I'll just use sleight of hand. Stop being so swift. <laughs> oh. I've never been hit, I tell you. <laughs> okay, so, uh, yeah, I would, like, grab my stuff and be like, Sylphie, I don't know what's going on, but I'll meet you downstairs. And I would, sure. I would like, exit the room as swiftly as possible. <laughs> you can do so. Okay. So, uh, Sylphie's gonna kind of watch him leave and then realize that she's, like, invisible and it's lasting a real long time. And she's gonna go to the mirror and just like see if there's any sign of her at all. Nothing. As you look at yourself before the mirror, it's, or as you look into the mirror, you simply see the empty room. Things I can do with this power. I know, right? You're dashing this ring. <laughs> well, I should rob the store that sold me this ring. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I was thinking about how uh, high magic is rampant in this world, and so it would make sense for shops and stuff like that to have anti-magic fields. Or, you know, theft. Uh, Sylvie's gonna grab her backpack and put that on to see if that turns invisible, too. Or if it's just a floating backpack. Just a floating backpack. Using her uh, pencil or any kind of like writing tool she has, she's gonna put a smiling face on the front of her bag and then just make it look like a floating face and then walk down to where Mal's is. Do you have it like flipped around? So yeah, it's, it's on the front, it's on the front. <laughs> okay. 
Mal's, uh, are you just trying to get breakfast down in the, the inn? Yeah, I, I'd have gone to sit down for breakfast. Okay, so that exchange, if you want, can just happen. It'll be five silver pieces. Cool. Can we be there since it's been hours? Yeah. Yeah, yeah if they want to meet us there for breakfast, that's fine, obviously. Yeah, I sort of suspect we'd already be there. If you walk in and you see Chris and, um, well, Tammy, are you also, or are you taking watch? Uh, probably if it gets, starts getting noisy enough that everyone's, I can't sleep, then yeah, she'll watch for now. Okay, so you'll stay with Sanchi. So you see Chris eating. <laughs> oh no, I am not paying for anything. Unless Tyler gave me food. <laughs> I mean, he would have come over to ask if you wanted food. No, no. I'm waiting for someone. <laughs> for a couple hours? It's fine, whatever. It's we fine. always it's meet at the inn or tavern. Yeah, I'm yeah, just doing my good. job. <laughs> he won't hassle you. He's also a little embarrassed about what happened. Um, so after a while, Miles, you come in and Chris is just sitting there angrily at a table. Finally, God, where have you been? Chris, oh, Chris, Chris, we we just went to bed, like, and like I look like towards like I don't know, maybe there's a magical contraption and like a hourglass, and I'm like, it must have been like six hours ago. Like, you know, <laughs> a good warrior needs his rest, as I'm sure a good performer does. I'm sure it was lovely. Some of us oh. were spending time with Senshi. <laughs> What, what do you mean, spending time with Sench? Isn't he, like, being punished at the moment? I don't know, man. What has even happened? Let's get out of here. What? No, uh, Chris, I wanted to... You know, have uh, breakfast. As you say that, a floating backpack comes into the room. What the... Oh. This no? is Jim. That's... Jim, you, you know this person. This floating <laughs> face. No, I don't understand what this is. Does this come with you? <laughs> What is happening? What, uh, 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 hello? Hello, I- Where's Sylvie? Oh, oh my god! <laughs> ah, Sylvie, uh... I've become something greater. Where are you? A bag of money. How much money? A lot of money. I, like, attempt to pick up the bag, like, to, like... like no, don't like, touch so me! Grab... Don't touch me! Ah! Okay. It wiggles. Okay. I was gonna, like, grab it by the handle and be like, what? Okay. Because I thought it's actually like a floating bag, I guess, but maybe not. This is me now. I've already accepted uh, it. Well, Chris doesn't have his bag. Would you like him to carry you? N no, I prefer to float. It's floating. Can I like ride you? I... Uh, no. I feel like that's going to stir up some, you know, curiosity around the city. Just a floating bag with a crudely drawn fist. Is that supposed to be eyes? I don't think anybody's gonna know. Are you notice. insulting my looks? This is what? so rude. Sylvie, yeah, obviously not. That is not the, the case. I don't think anyone's gonna notice. Sky's got a floating purple thing. The morph. A patron oh, walks into the backpack and is Hey, watch it! Hey, what? careful, that's our friend! Your friend is a backpack. Yes, I'm a backpack. Oh, for that it's... grievous injurious injury, I need money. That's my blood. You need my... to feed me money. God, Have you never God, been to an adventuring it. town before? <laughs> what? I've never seen such a heinous thing before, no. Heinous? heinous. What? Oh my God! Oh Keep my talking. Oh, I'm just going to leave. This is weird and awkward. <laughs> Yeah, just a little bit. He runs out. Noobs, okay, am I uh, right? <laughs> well, Sylvie, do you eat any more in this form? Sylvie's gonna open, like, the flap of the backpack and make it look like it's munching on the gold coins inside. <laughs> I eat coins now. I, well, Chris, where, where do they go? Google <laughs> this while I eat breakfast. The bag? So we'll kind of yes. handle it. You want me to, like, pin it down? <laughs> no, no, just 
just make sure. I, I don't know, maybe look into why Silky is apparently a bag. Why I, is it a problem I, if I'm a bag now? I tap on <laughs> the bench for her to sit. Silky, so, I don't think people are normally just bags. What are you what's making wrong with that? that? Yeah, she's making a talk as this is happening. What's wrong with what? who I am? There's, Silky, there's nothing wrong with who you are, but are you sure you are in fact a bag? I am. This has been my true form all along. You know what? Uh, well then, I guess I'm... you're like a bag with a sentience. I am. I, I've ascended. I, I'm like a god of bags and money. I okay, eat money. Well, Sophie, well uh, see. So, hmm, how do I put this? I. Maybe it's best then that you return to Miss Choi's as I'm not sure. Well, can you still do your regular magic? I am perfectly capable of all things a magic bag can do. Such as casting well, magic. Magic bags can cast magic? Yes. And she's going <laughs> she's going to take a gold coin out of the mouth and say, "Look, I'm casting mage hand." Is, is the coin like floating around? Like, describe this to me. Yeah, it's just she's just like waving it around in there. Wait, you can see Mage Hand, can't you? It's like ethereal, but you can see it, can't you? Uh, normally, yes, you can usually see it. This is Ascendant Mage Hand. Mage Hand it can only be used by the most rich and powerful. <laughs> Do you want this to be a deception like roll, <laughs> guys? I feel like this. Malzahar wouldn't know. Like, there's I no way for Malzahar to know, right? He's not a mage. I'll buy it. I don't give a shit. I don't think she's she changed all that much. I would just be like, what? <laughs> I look at Chris like, what? It's fine. Just sit down. Does do bags eat breakfast? I eat gold coins for breakfast now. Well, you got one right oh, there. <laughs> she's gonna make it look like the bag is gobbling up the gold coin as it goes back into the mouth. I hope that's enough for uh, you know the good nom, long nom, while. Nom, nom. Okay, uh, I'll wave over, like, the lurch waiter, dude. Alright. <laughs> you rang. Oh, wait. Uh, yes, uh, I think, uh, you know, some hearty meats and, uh, eggs, maybe, this morning, if possible. Of course, sir. And he goes off to get that. Alright, well, Chris, Chris uh, bag Sylvie, would we give you, like, anything? Well, she's got coins. I think I'm gonna try a coin, and I like start like nomming on a coin. Don't, don't, don't Chris, actually do Chris, that. Don't need no, a coin. That's not a good. That's not a good idea. It's hard. <laughs> oh my god. How do you do it? You just swallow it whole. I <laughs> put the coin in my mouth. <laughs> no, don't, don't eat the coin. Chris, just put it, put it, put it in, put it in my backpack. I can roll. If he's doing dumb shit, he should have to roll if he accidentally swallows it and then he chokes and dies. I picture, I picture it's a little too big for me to swallow. Okay. Yeah, like How it's your whole coins? Well, no, I'm no, tiny. No, no, no. I'm like a third of your size. Like it's a size. Still be smaller than a gold. I don't know. <laughs> and then coppers would coppers be smaller than silvers? Uh, no, they're all the same size, but they're different shapes. Damn it. Cause I'm. Oh wait, different. Okay, well, well, Chris, what about these? And I'll place a copper and a silver. Like, oh, you mean Doritos you and Smarties? <laughs> Sylvie's gonna just uh, make the backpack try and gobble them up. Hi, <laughs> low. Bag, bag. Backpack. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> nom, 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 nom. You can roll, you can a, roll a sleight of hand to get those coins on the table. Oh my god, you bitch. <laughs> Can I versus oh, her? She actually rolled well. Yeah, if all of you want to try, um, you can do it at disadvantage because she did do it perfectly timed. I wouldn't react. I mean, I'm placing them down for Chris to grab, so I'm not paying attention to them. Meanwhile, Chris is failing. Yeah, Sophie Bag gets the coins. <laughs> I, I demand her icon be changed to a backpack. My immersion is ruined. She's actually That's how you I ever, got the idea. <laughs> you ever feed your backpack before? No, what? No. 
She's I like hungry. The, I like to imagine Sophie's puppeteering this thing like a Muppet on or like Sesame Street or something. It's like perfect. Like flapping its it's like flap. <laughs> I'm um, just continue to RP. The food arrives. Um, if you want to add any food for the other two, you can. What do you think saw the itinerary for the day? Right. Wait, are, are the books in the bag? And I try to like open the bag to look in there. Don't look at my bag. <laughs> oh God. Oh. Okay, Chris, it's very rude to look in a bag's bag. I'm trying to find the book Thanks. that. Sylphie used to write in. It doesn't look like the book can write anymore. Ooh, Sylphie, is it in your bag? That book is always on Sylphie's person. Oh, it's, it's gone. It must have ate it. How does it digest the book and the coins, and what does it do with them? I, I mean, there's I other stuff in here. <laughs> I'm sustained by their magic power. I've ascended beyond the need for mortal foods. Sophie, can you control that backpack? Yep. <laughs> can we, like, get a sense at all that she's actually a person wearing the, like, messing with the backpack, or is it completely unknown? <laughs> Make perception checks at advantage, because her, the backpack loops would have, like, like, be in a... Yeah, I think she took it off. Her shoulders. <laughs> and like, if you're looking close enough, maybe we'll see. And I was touching her, or at least the backpack. This is this is true. You've interacted with it. You can sort of feel that parts of it has give. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So yeah, you are definitely getting the sense that it, it looks like somebody is wearing this backpack, and you see like whenever. A coin was getting eaten. You saw like the fold in the lip of the, like the rim of the. <laughs> where she's like pinching it. Yeah, yeah, where her hand is going into her mouth to like put the coin in, kind of thing. Like, all right, it's still Sylphie, or do you have a new name like uh, Backpack or something? I like I like uh, Backpack Sylphie. Backpack Sylphie. All right, Backpack Sylphie. And I like wink at pals. <laughs> Wait, what? What? I'm just eating my food. I like I I actually said that uh, to Chris. I'm like I'm just eating my food. <laughs> I'm not, I I do not care for the situation at the moment. I need <laughs> looks, sustenance. Looks pretty good. Can I have a sausage. Oh. Chris, you could have ordered your own food. I was a hungry, but now I'm hungry. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to order mine because it'll take so long to get there. <laughs> I, wait, did I even get sausages? Because I was like, hearty meats. I assumed like bacon. Maybe yeah. Maybe some I, sausage. Maybe some ham. I picture like it's a really good meal. Like it's got ha it's got potato. It's got it's a Denny's meal. Oh, never mind. Oh, take it back. <laughs> I like I Denny's. I'm not a fan of Denny's. Let's Ew. go home. Like it's Denny's. breakfast. What? We can't okay. be friends. <laughs> Cora's? Can we agree with Cora's? Yes, Cora's is great. Okay. Cora's is Cora's fantastic. Is great. Yes. Okay. We do right, Cora's. It's a Cora's it's breakfast. Okay, okay, it's... You know what? After you're hungover, it's the fucking best. No. Get big K hot chocolate. Cold KFC. Chocolate. Cold KFC is the best. God, oh, God, no. <laughs> I actually haven't had that friends. in years. It's been years. Just okay, the skins. KFC ever. What? What? Just oh, the skins. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, to, to jump out of this conversation, uh, Tammy, so Sarah, because since she's not here, I don't want to do his RP stuff. Um, That's fair. So it like it would happen if you want to stay there for a very long time, but like you can come and join the group if you would like. Otherwise, it's or do something else. I do want to go possibly shopping a bit later, so I might. Quote unquote off screen, talk with Sanchi, see if he's okay with it, and probably yes, he's okay with it or something. Okay, or we can like time jump whenever he's here because like it would happen sort of early day, is what I was figuring, but because he's not here. So like we can time jump whenever he's here to have it come back if you want to do your stuff. Yeah. Uh, Up to you. And we can uh, go back to them, I think. 
we can go back to them for now. I'll want to shop eventually, but okay. You're happy listening? It's been pretty great. I am happy with yeah. the feedback. <laughs> I lost my shit. Okay. You we'll go back. You guys can eat your breakfast, have all that, and then you want Alright, well, I guess uh, we have some time to kill today. Uh, Chris, Dilfy Backpack, what did you guys have plans of any kind? Like, I'm kind of feeling like a nap, but uh, yeah, no plans. <laughs> I, I did give him a piece of sausage. A nap? Oh, I, I heard app, like, as in, like, an appetizer. I'm like, no, I, well, I thought you, you were eating the sausage. Okay, but no, like, a, a nap? Yeah, you like, a nap. You just want to sleep the entire day away. Yeah, well, I only got, what, like, four hours of sleep. Oh. Oh, Chris. Oh, that is Dark circles dreadful. under his eyes. How, how long do I have this room at the inn for? I assume, is this, like, I have kind of, like, a, not, like, a permanent, but, like, a semi- Permanent situation going you on. You got a semi. <laughs> oh my! Yeah, I just got a tiny <laughs> bit of a semi. <laughs> um. Yeah, and when like every day we can say if you want to keep the room for the day, it'll cost you what do I five gold pieces? Let me check the prices. No, it was more oh, than that. Was it? No. Yeah, it was. It was expensive. Like. <laughs> okay, music. <laughs> What's a lot to like here at it's the like Harbor Inn? <laughs> Stay a night at the modest inn costs 50 gold pieces per night. <laughs> Get out of here, Tyler. <laughs> Silphy paid for last night. I'll, I'll like, put the bill for this day. Oh my god, I you paid, made the girl pay for the room? Well, she said if we share, she'll pay. Now she did say that. Okay, so I'm down to... And Malzahar's like, that's good math. <laughs> How much did that cost yeah. again? I want to remove that from my... Uh, 50 gold pieces. Yeah. Uh, the backpack's gonna like turn towards... My body for less. Uh, Malzahar. <laughs> I cannot afford the room that we already slept in. What? What do you... Well, didn't you not pay last night? She ate all Wait, the money. I? I assume they would've demanded... I, I'll payment give it to you, yeah. Game. Like, it's a new day. We'll say you took it I, off. Because I can't remember if I took it out of my money already. <laughs> Yeah, and I can't remember if Sky did it either, so we'll just we'll say it's clean. Well, I got the room today. So yeah, that'll... So if you, if you want to chill there, maybe, Chris, if you need to take a nap, you could... Please I, I not... need to find Tammy. Oh, well, I don't... Where did you plan to look? Because I was going to head uh, off-island, actually. Uh, alleyways, dumpsters, the cat establishments... The cat... Do you, do you mean the tavern and the inn where we currently preside? Yes. Well, last time I saw her, she was in the stockade. Oh, cats in do go in the sometimes. stockade? Well, like Can around it. Oh, okay. I'm distracted by the vibing going on. <laughs> I love it. I'm just like standing on the, the bench seat, like, snapping my fingers and salsing. <laughs> <laughs> Mouse, why do you have to go off the island? Uh, well, I hadn't actually, uh, talking to my mentor in some time, and I figured I have the day to kill. I might as well go, uh, receive some tutelage. Oh no, why do I have to choose? I want to meet your well, mentor. No, no, no Sylphie. Bag, Sylphie. Uh, you, you should, uh, find backpack Tammy. Also, a backpack, Sylphie. You should, uh, apprise, or, like, you know, show her what's up, I guess. Fuck. Like, I don't is know this, if everybody's gonna. Get is this, this right like away. a metaphor? Should I not come to breakfast anymore? <laughs> Chris, go this take a, a nap. This is a sex I, thing. I would pass Chris my room key. <laughs> no, no, I'm not sleeping. This, I know it's making a mistake. Oh, oh, okay. Well, then give me my key back. This this establishment turns people into backpacks. I thought you ascended. It's a smear campaign. <laughs> I, oh I ascended, God. but at the same time, it wasn't my choice. It's like I it's go to cult. poke the bag. I go to poke the bag. That, Don't like, poke I'm me. starting to be like, this is weird. Do, Don't poke me. Like, I would actually try to poke the bag. Do I feel like anything... You can make a perception check at advantage yeah. for this. You okay. didn't do it before, but now you're looking. 
poker in the yeah, valley, like, or she does a weird bend and you miss. She's like the hotels to. Oh my god. This is average. Um, Sylvie, what do you do as he's like reaching towards you? Are you smacking him? Are you pulling away? Yes, smack my hand away. Do it. At this point, I don't think it's a very good like charade. <laughs> Ten probably sufficient. It's okay. I was like, that's pretty average. So, yeah, you definitely you're like, this is Sylvie in a fucking backpack. Sylvie, are you invisible? Maybe. I, I thought you why. were a backpack. <laughs> I look at Chris uh, and like, can I can I do inside? Like, does does he is he lying? Or did he know the whole time? You have to guess. As your character. No Honestly, the way he said that, the way he said that, I was like... He did Christine wink at you earlier. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm like, I'm like, remembering all this, I'm like, Chris, you knew? I'm like, she could be whatever she wants to be, man. Just supportive and stuff, right? And I like, do like the nudgy elbow towards him. <laughs> Chris, I don't think that's how it works uh, just let her creativity flow man she's you know f finding her body or whatever they say <laughs> well now that now that you both kind of, well at least Mel's knows uh i think my ring started working and she's gonna hold it up the ring but then realize that she's invisible so it was like a pointless gesture what's happening it's just went silent <laughs> yeah <laughs> I, I got a ring from like that scam jewelry shop and it just started working. What what does it do? He's gonna like kind of just look at Mal's invisible. I mean, it did ring. nothing when we were there. <laughs> it was just sticky. Uh -oh. Yes, I see. Do you? I'm not a wise or intelligent man. Okay. Yeah, it's fantastic. Well, uh, I'll be going then, um, wait, and I'll stand wait. up. Wait, I want to see. I want to meet your mentor, uh, Sylvie. Um, maybe another time when we have reason to bring the whole group. But I think today I need to. Uh, I need to be alone with my thoughts, and like uh, on my travels and so on. And I, I don't want to put you through the strain in your current condition with the. Uh, the means of transportation, remembering the uh, boat ride being rocky as shit. Um, just to have a little bit of like, be, that way we don't split the party even more. Um, okay. What about going, or like, uh, this is an option, but like Sophie could offer to, like you accompany her for her thing first and then go do the other thing? Like, do you need to go all day? Mine will be quick. I don't know. Putting it out there. Uh, I feel like searching the city for Tammy wouldn't... Well, I guess we know she's near the stockades, but it's like... I don't know... I, I guess I could help Sylphie. It's just like I don't see Mal's motivation to do so. What does like, Sylphie I think it'd be like, do? Tammy's a grown-up woman. She knows what she's doing. She'll um... come find us when she's done kind of thing. Meanwhile, she's literally Chris just a cat. Sorry, what? Message. Yeah, what? No, I'm, what did you say, I love how you're like, oh, Tammy's an adult, and she'll find us, and she's somewhere near the stockade. She's literally not left the tree she was in when Chris left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like, she, I don't know why they're observing Senshi necessarily. Like he's serving his punishment when he's done. We'll go grab him. Because he's got guards. Like, he's okay. <laughs> I'm worried about him. Maybe you could go ask. I don't know. Yeah, his, yeah, that's a fair point. His emotional. Right, well, how about so. how about before we make any decisions then on what to do with the day? Because maybe we'll just relax actually. Because I know we want to make another run at the, uh, you know the, uh, and I say it under my breath like the thieves guild tonight. Uh, but, uh, I guess we should go check it with Tammy and see what her plans for the day are to see if she plans to hang around with Senshi the whole time if she's at the stockades. What are we doing with, like, Sky? Because I assume we would be waiting for her as well. 
That's fair. Um, <laughs> She's relapsed into a scarecrow. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> She's like in the bench with us. <laughs> we'll put her in the bag. Um, during your breakfast, uh, Lurch came down with a letter. You guys read it. <laughs> no, that doesn't work. She can't write. <laughs> this is just a bunch of scribbles. <laughs> I, I picture like a confident guy writing something like, you know, and then it fl- fast forwards to us and it shows the note and it's like a picture person like doing some weird thing and we're like with an arrow pointing into some like random direction yeah. yeah we don't like like she can't write but she's like trying to like do illustrate pictures. yeah i figured yeah, that exactly. yeah she i don't speak it. orphan guys but i might know a few kids who could read this <laughs> um we'll say that she does that we'll say that she draws um that she's staying in her room tonight to sleep. so i picture a house with like arrows on all sides and her inside it on a bed. <laughs> yeah, like sleeping. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, and then this guy's robbing somewhere. a tomb. Oh, did she it, maybe she found some treasure. She's oh, she's, tell us. she's drawing mustaches on pillows. <laughs> what? You don't Where see you the the zigzaggy things? What yeah, no, what are those? Do the we have Z's. Z's in our alphabet here? I don't know if Z's are in our alphabet. Your name Maybe. is Al Zahar. You would know. I would yeah, say it. but it's not. It's written in an elven, like, language thing. So then you would think in elvish, and you would see that Z. Is I that think, Z? I think oh, it would be it random really letters, because she doesn't dicks. know to write. You so guys never like use? Three dicks above her head. It looks like a smoke cloud. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe she looks dead in her room, but no, it looks like sleeping. So uh, you guys don't okay. check on her. Okay. Maybe she needs some time. Did something traumatic happen? <laughs> There's a uh, picture of a clock. <laughs> the clock's like set to a time. Yeah, maybe, yeah, like, maybe like two o'clock. <laughs> sleeping in. We'll I feel four. like we need someone to decipher this. Maybe we should go to the orphanage. <laughs> And have the kids this is his mustache like, drawn time? Here. What's happening? <laughs> oh, oh, we could just find a kid on the streets. I'm sure nothing could go wrong just asking a kid to come and look at this picture for us. Yeah, I know. I feel like I recognize the face when I see it. <laughs> oh, speaking of which, we have to finalize that deal with them selling our shirts, right? Yes, yeah, probably. <laughs> I told him to sell them, and we would pay him like ten silver or something. And then how? Uh, how much are they selling them for? Oh, uh, you know what? <laughs> oh, tell no. you what. I'll try and support. The I, I don't even know. I'll buy a shirt. The backpack frowns. The I want to go buy a jingle shirt. sadly. <laughs> I think I told them to talk to Greg, but, uh... How far yeah. do I have to walk till I find a kid selling t-shirts? <laughs> okay, uh, first, because it's a new day, um, either Chris or Sylvie, you guys can argue amongst yourselves, roll me a d20. Argue, argue, argue. <laughs> <laughs> you can roll it. <laughs> <laughs> you can have the privilege. I did it. I stole it. Uh... Okay, so nine t-shirts have been sold. But you do see um, kids, sort of, the market is nearby. You would be able to hear, Lexi Fox t-shirts, come get your Lexi Fox t-shirts. Made in cooperation with Sophie Joy. I I, I would run towards this. I'm like, are these legitimate? Like, I assume it's like over in this direction towards the market. Are these legitimate Lexi Fox t-shirts? And then I look back at Chris, like, starry-eyed, like... (gasps) Um, so you can run up on this little girl. She's got a little like pitch pat or pitch patch what patchwork bag um, <laughs> that looks like it has a bunch of t-shirts in it, and she's holding one up. It is what did it, what did it look like? Did it just say Lexi Fox? Oh, I don't remember. It has like my face or something on it. To her dates. I think, <laughs> I think it was the oh, token model that didn't have a shirt on. 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah, nice. like an embroidered. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, Matt, can we print this shirt IRL and I'll wear it one day on stream? Like... <laughs> the, the picture's so <laughs> ugly, though. I have to get someone Perfect. to draw it well. I want it. <laughs> okay, but, um, yeah, I would... Uh, how much for the shirt? Ten silver pieces. Oh, uh, mm. Oh, no. Somebody throws up. This is you say. <laughs> Ten silver pieces you say. Oh. Uh, mm. Tell you what, maybe if... Let me try the shirt. I'll give you seven silver pieces for it. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> You're a what? swindler, mister. What? What do you mean I'm a swindler? <laughs> that is, that what is, is this, not... What is this even made of? These need to be 13 gold. <laughs> what is happening? No. You're yelling uh, at I'll, a child? I will... Ten, f ten silver pieces, fine. And I would hand the ten silver pieces over. Thank you very much. Here you go. Here you go. I got one. Before the price goes up. <laughs> I like that kid, though. <laughs> He's got pizzazz. Some of these kids are like Would not business people. <laughs> Sophie, I see where you get it from. This sounds crazy. Sophie's gonna draw two very angry eyebrows on the front of her backpack. <laughs> oh Holding God. the shirt to my chest, like, look! look at I, I knew it was mustache time! Why is there two, though? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Uh, is this that what I'm wearing now? I'm wearing that on my, on my person? Yeah. Nice. That's on your body. <laughs> Can you blow that up? I can't. Like, how do I make this bigger? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Goodness gracious. <laughs> so bad. So good. <laughs> it was funny to draw it. I was like, this is outrageous. Look like Chris. Does this, like... Is this a spitting image of Chris? It's talking? supposed to I'm be, like, but yeah. I have a bad draw, mm. especially of the face. <laughs> There's Lexi and Fox on here. Nudge, nudge. <laughs> Can I nudge Chris? Like what? <laughs> right. Cool shit, bro. <laughs> okay, uh, little, little orphan child, you need to listen to me. Hi, would you like right to buy now. a Lexi Fox shirt? No, I own the Lexi Fox shirts. You need to start selling them at 13 gold. Say that any you sold already were promotion deals for the first few that came. Wait, who would buy this for 13 gold? Uh, I'm gonna need to hear that from my boss. I am your boss. Ah. Yeah, you could sell them a little higher if you want. No, they need to. We're gonna lose all of our money. <laughs> our um, investment. Make it either, okay. make an intimidation check on her. Sylphie, don't you know money isn't everything? It's my life. Oh blood. Jesus! <laughs> this is Sophie is serious. <laughs> How much money did we sink into this? <laughs> like five hundred gold. Each or just together? It was uh, two fifty each. Okay, that was a lot. That's a, that's a good chunk. And then one silver piece per child. It's not hard labor. We're uh, paying the children. What is this? One You're silver the piece. Fucking children. I think um, the backpack is having a panic attack. <laughs> it's like heaving weirdly. <laughs> Sophie backpack. We could just we could give the shirts away. It will just oh draw God. more people no, to. No, no <laughs> girl's can... gonna yell at my backpack. We cannot <laughs> give the shirts away. Right. This is this is this is horrible. It's marketing, man. Wait. We gotta. Is well, there anything on the shirt, like a tour date, like dates for shows, maybe at Tilly's? Is there any? Did you do any promotion with yeah, the there's, shirt? There's promote. There's it says uh, Lexi Fox on it, and it also has an advertisement for uh, the store that we have an agreement with, and then it has like uh, Sylvie Choi on it as well. Like, so no one. tour dates or anything like that. It's more like yeah. a soccer jersey. Yeah. <laughs> oh. With Greg's garments embroidered on it as well. It's bejeweled, actually. <laughs> oh. But this little girl was just yelled at by a backpack. Um, very frighteningly as well. So she's going to start crying. <laughs> she's going to be like, ah! Oh, 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 come, come. I, I would, like, go to console her, but hopefully, like, I don't know if she would accept it. I'd be like, oh, there, there. It's okay. Show your muscles or something. It's not Girls okay. Like None that. of this is okay. <laughs> Yeah, like what's a charisma? Sophie, obviously, you need to 
discuss this with the the child's. You said you have a boss. Oh my. Okay. Uh, who's Jimmy. your boss, little girl? Jimmy. Jimmy. Okay, D Sylphie, Do you know a Jimmy? I'm the boss, man. That's my face on the shirt. <laughs> Says it's Lexi Fox. Yeah, I'm I'm the the guy who's putting them out. I'm selling them. It's Sylphie. It well, backpack face. Sylphie. It is. So you rank. <laughs> oh well, yeah. Well, it, it's my face, but it's it's under Lexi's name, right? You get it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm, right, because yes, I do the I do the performance. Now. I put on the costume. I do, a, I do an overly <laughs> exaggerated wink. Okay, little little orphan child, you need to go to Jimmy right now and say, 13 gold per shirt. Does, does this shirt have, like, special properties? What's it made of? 13 gold? Uh, the little girl's crying if the backpack tries to talk to her again. I'll have Mal's roll something to, like, console the child. Um, okay. But I can't open your character sheet to see what that would be. Animal handling. <laughs> I'll allow it. <laughs> <laughs> Nature. Okay, let's do it. Persuasion. Yeah, like, like a charisma check. Okay, or, yeah, or charisma. That's a solid one, so that's okay. I average. You averagely calm this child down. People definitely are looking at you because they're in the middle of a market at around 11 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, like when a like... white man touches a weird kid. <laughs> Oh no. A little they're, bit. They're, they're, they're thoroughly distracted. distracted by the backpack, though. What are you all looking at? Okay. This isn't a show, unless you're paying. Um, no, 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 no. <laughs> mean to stare. I'm trying to make my money back, Mel. I'm in the hole 250. Okay, I, I gestured to the girl, girl, can I have another shirt? And I give her another 10 silver. No, they're 13 <laughs> gold now. Oh, they're selling <laughs> like hotcakes, man. <laughs> this guy bought Does two. Can you give me another shirt? Um, with your 10, that's pretty average, so she's not going to be giving you things. Uh, damn it. Not, no, not no, enough to, to do her job. One. <laughs> How about 15 silver? You can keep the extra 5 silver. No, she can't. Tips go to the owners. Oh no, my... Sylvie, I'm not, I'm not tipping her. Back. It's scary. Sylvie, stand over there. I'm floating. Does she agree to sell me the shirt for 15 silver? If we the should just leave. Away. Okay, this kid's so crazy. Stand over there. We're going to fix this. What? How are you going to fix this? You're just, trying just, to scam me. You're literally trying to scam me right now okay. out of 13 Stand gold. over there. No. No. I said, give me the shirt. I'm taking the shirts. This backpack's going to gobble the shirts. <laughs> You're going to try to steal the shirt from the kid? Tell me, what are you doing? In my shirt, it's not stealing. She throws her fucking backpack oh off God. and just starts running. Yeah, get out of here. Oh Here's my God. Mine. No. Oh my God. We need to leave. We need to leave. <laughs> Everyone saw that. Which okay. my shirts. What does it mean? What does it Tell matter me. if they it... We need to leave. <laughs> I start leaving. Because <laughs> they're like, okay, this is done. Chris, Chris, come quickly. <laughs> All right. And we're going to Miss Joy's. We're going to Miss Joy's. <laughs> oh, nice. How to see Barth Bottom. We're Sylvie telling her mother. Sylvie grabs the backpack. Why are you telling my mother? I didn't do anything. <laughs> oh, my God, Sylvie. Okay. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> I assume I hear this, and I'm just like... You do hear to hear the sound of a chicken or a turkey. You're not sure. Okay. How's your water yeah, power? I'm, sure I'm sure it's one of those. I'm sure. <laughs> I would I would carefully make my way towards Miss Choice still. Uh, Sophie's become two backpacks I would just, now. I would just like forget about the whole possibly waterfowl noise. It's like I don't have time for you today. <laughs> not today, Satan. Okay. All right, so you successfully get to Miss Choi's shop. Um, so so you, have, you have two bags? What? Sylvia's multiplied? She took the little, <laughs> she took the little, the little uh, kid's bag that oh. had like the shirt. 
Baz, so that know. one's on her back now. So it's just like two floating backpacks. Baz, I don't know if this is concerning you, but backpack <laughs> selfies multiply? It does look like a different bag. Maybe it's a curse. We should probably have guys... Miss Choi deal with it. Oh, yeah, that rig. It's not a curse. I'm, I'm just invisible, wearing backpacks. Well, can you become uninvisible? Why would I do that? There's so many benefits to being invisible. Now that little girl can't tell on me. There's also, well, there's also many not good th Wait, what the hell? Name one bad thing about me being invisible right now. Well, I can't see you. You can sneak into people's rooms and they can't see you. That is a benefit. Oh, that's kind of creepy, though. That's just a little. That's a little. Just wait. Creepy. Just wait until yeah. we have to assassinate someone. Then you'll be thanking me. You'll be going some silky backpack. Sylvie, back what are you talking about? We are adventurers. We've already got on that story arc. <laughs> we burnt down a witch's house and killed her and gassed her and threw her in a grave. What do you mean? Well, actually, Tammy was, did that. I Tammy don't know if I went. We we yeah. were bystanders to a heinous crime. right now Pardon? okay okay if i if i admit that i got a little heated about the shirts will you not tell my mom about me taking the backpack from the orphan i mean there's like six <laughs> sides on the way up here to say no stealing <laughs> you just took a backpack from a I child i didn't steal the backpack she dropped it and i picked it up and it's my it's my stuff anyway I'm so going to die if you walk into that shop. Please do not walk into that shop and say anything. I'm literally going to die. You are killing me. You did, you can you should dig your, my grave before you walk into Miss Choi's odds and ends. Just just get it out of the way first. I haven't heard backpack Sylvie talk like this before. I think <laughs> yeah, she's serious. <laughs> okay, maybe we don't need to involve your mother and I get a shiver down my spine. Uh, and I move away from the door. The curtain like, like... <laughs> shifts a bit. <laughs> she senses. Like she had one eye looking out. <laughs> she sees all. Hey, Bartholomew. <laughs> Sylvie, uh, let's let's uh, let's let's drop by the orphanage and just uh, leave leave the bag inside, and then and and then she'll just like she's gonna take out her book, but no one can see it, and she just puts a negative next to the two fifty. <laughs> <laughs> just here there's 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 some tears going down her face but nobody can see it it's just silence as she puts the <laughs> negative next to it well let's get this all sorted at the orphanage and then we can go from there and go check on tammy i think that's what you originally wanted to do no yeah yeah that's what i wanted to do backpack sophie yeah that might well, be like jimmy is orphan? She I draws a tear underneath the backpack's eye. Now there's like angry eyebrows and a tear, so it's looking really weird. Lauren, okay. on the way to the orphanage, do we see another orphan? Because I'd want to buy more shirts. Or at least one more. Uh, let's see. Roll me a D100. I just like okay. bump into Sylphie's leg. I'm like, ugh! <laughs> Watch where you're going. <laughs> Wait, you can't. Never mind. Just don't hit me. Look for the backpack. I'm floating. Just like watch the bag fly away. <laughs> Whoa. It's hard. Like you're floating, but you're not. I mean, it's cool. Whatever you want to be. If you want to be a bag or your cat or whatever. I just want to be invisible forever. It's great. So on the way to the orphanage, um, you don't see any more kids. You're pretty close to, until you obviously get within like the courtyard of it, then you start seeing all the kids, but no more selling t-shirts. All right, fair enough. Also, Sylphie, if you're invisible, how is anybody supposed to appreciate your wonderful, beautiful self? Oh, he's got you there. Oh, now you gotta come on the um, invisible. Um, uh, I can see um, her blushing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is she turning like a red, like red invisibility, like just red light shade thing? Yeah, she's she's like blushing, and then she's gonna draw blush marks on the backpack. <laughs> a little like pink so smudges. Right. I, 
I need to think about this. Let's just go to the orphanage and drop off this bag this sorted out. that yes. I didn't steal. She dropped it while she ran away. Yeah, well, yeah, if we return it, then we're returning it. <laughs> no, we're, we're just, yeah, we're just, we're just bringing it back to the orphanage. You don't have to mention that you did steal it, you just, like, here, sorry. <laughs> wait, wait, no, neither of you have to even, like, go there so that no one can uh, put us at the place of the crime, and she's gonna, like, sprint ahead. And just, <laughs> how, are just, like, how are they gonna see you? You're they don't need to see me, that's the, the point. And she's just she's gonna just open the orphanage just... and then throw the bag in and just run away. <laughs> what? It works, like, you're a bag. <laughs> And it might get some looks at a sprinting bag, but like... Did you see yeah, Timmy just... in there, though? We needed to talk to him. I don't want to see any of them right now. Let's just go. Don't you need to sort out your business? It's over. The business is over. It's all a loss. I've lost everything. It'll be fine. I have to sell, like, all, all my possessions. These are just, just the beginning. Statue. Wait, I can't statue? make my statue now. What I had, statue? like... It was gonna be beautiful. An invisible statue? It was gonna be the most beautiful statue anyone had ever seen, but it no longer exists because we have no profit. So let's find Tammy. I'm a very sad backpack right now. Tear marks? You're blushing yeah, though. Me. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's got angry eyebrows, blush marks, like, and yeah. multiple tears. <laughs> This bag is a mess of emotions. I know, right? Maybe you should talk to Sophie about it. You know, me and Mal's like walk like 10 feet behind her. <laughs> like, man. I think she might have a problem. A bit complicated. I mean, My just... problem is that I'm poor now. My investments fell flat. Well, we can, after we go check on Tammy, how about we go and grab a tiny little quest that can line our pockets a bit? Yeah, you got the goose one still. The real wealth comes from within, though. You don't need t-shirts or shiny coins. Oh, really? How many shows have you played for free? I don't know. People just give me money. <laughs> Alright. Uh, do we want to go check on Tammy? Yeah, let's go, let's go check uh, where Senshi is. She's probably there. Yeah. Or in a nearby alley. Eating <laughs> fish. Okay. Um, just before we jump to Tammy, uh, I'm going to say a five-minute break because I have to go pee. That's okay. okay. This was hilarious, though. Right. You're very ruined. Ruined! <laughs> My investments are all gone. Oh, no. <laughs> I feel like you're giving up on that so quickly. I feel like you can <laughs> your There's just, I just cause... don't see people spending 13 gold on it. That's unrealistic. No, like, at, at this point, she's realized that... Because she didn't intend for the orphans to even have the shirts at this point. She doesn't know that, like, half that stuff happened. And knowing that they're just all over the place with orphans, there's no, like, accountability for even if they were selling them for 13 gold. The orphans would probably just pocket most of it. And, like, it's just... It's such a lost cause that she doesn't so see any real... you now realizing way. your business model was utterly fucking terrible. That's what you're saying? Yeah, but it wasn't finalized yet. She didn't know about the orf. <laughs> <laughs> she's just she's just accepting that everything has gone wrong, and, and it's all crumbling probably, around her. Chris like, should probably not be trusted with business. <laughs> Why didn't you just have Greg at Greg's garments put him on his shelves? I wanted that. He's supposed to, but the kids are supposed to spread it. Yeah, they're like the marketing department. It's just the beginning. On the plus side, they may actually sell all those shirts. You're just going to rake in, like, you know, maybe 50 gold instead of the 250 or 500 you spent in total. So. It's I can't already remember negative. How, yeah, I can't remember how many shirts we got, but it's pretty bad already. Lauren views them as, like, dollars. So, like, 13 gold is, like, $13. I feel like your gold being a dollar is very generous. This is going to be Sophie's depression arc now. Her, like, first business venture in, like, so long, it just it just failed horrendously. I feel like we already have depressed heroines. That's business. God. 
the hamster business went so well. She doesn't know where it went wrong. <laughs> God. That poor hamster. <laughs> that was so unexpected. I had... I don't know what it was. I had some meat that made magic happen. And the oh, hamster no, no. The ate some... Oh, sky hamster I know. But I was like, I thought Sylphie's, like, she had a different hamster venture. What happened to that one? Oh, and yeah, that's part of her backstory. So, like, when she was little, she would uh, she would go to the pet store in town and buy out all the hamsters and then sell them to the lizard folk for, like, double Why the price. Why the lizard folk? Because they eat rodents. <laughs> oh, my God. You're selling the pet hamsters as, like, a del delicacy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh for like God. double, <laughs> she'd get like double her money back. Oh my God. And she also sold them to the orphanage when the when the orphan ha orphanage hamster would die. She would show up and in the uh, she orphanage and would sell. Why <laughs> her hamster? Yeah, die. that's what she did. Wow, that's a uh, that's something. Nice. Now she now she's banned from the pet store, and all the animals shriek when she goes near. <laughs> yeah, that kind of makes sense. And now I get blamed for the bad business decision. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Alrighty. Jesus, that was a terrible model. <laughs> Maybe Sylphie's just really bad at business. She tries really hard, but she's just terrible. <laughs> no, she's bad at legitimate business. She's great at illegal business. <laughs> yeah, just like her mom. <laughs> <laughs> We're all here. I would not know where Tammy is personally, so I would probably. I'd assume Chris is gonna tell me, but maybe not. Probably because it's Chris. Let's be serious. I don't know where she went. Was she like thirty feet up? You I can't see that far. Her. You thumbs up her. You <laughs> knew in a general vicinity where the fuck she was, didn't you? I'm like walking around the trees. I'm like, what are these ones? <laughs> I kick it, but like, there's no, <laughs> there's no impact whatsoever. Meanwhile, Tam was just watching this go down and like, what is he up to now? Quietly ramming it. I just yell at another tree. Hey, you in there? Huh? Mouse, mouse, hold my backpack. Hold my backpack, and she's going to try and hand off what? the backpack to uh, Malzahar. Just leave it at my feet. Okay, she's going to put it at his feet, and then she's going to uh, go towards wherever she heard Tammy and sneak. She's going to sneak. <laughs> you are essentially invisible. Um, Tammy, what have you been doing in the trip? Mostly just trying to... Well, I can't sleep at this point, so mostly just watching Senshi and making sure no one pulled any shit on him. Okay. So, Sophie, if you're just... if you Are you watching, like, all of them? You just, just see a backpack get handed to Mal's, but if you aren't really looking at them... I depend. guess I would... They're close enough that I would have probably seen them come, I guess. Is there a crowd yeah, she is like, what, she is what, Okay, she's basically surveying that square and making sure no one's coming in. And doing anything wrong, so she probably would have seen them. Okay, so you did see the two of them. You saw a backpack. Maybe you didn't see it exactly, but you do notice the backpack. But so I'll give you a perception roll against Sophie's stealth, but Sophie will get advantage on stealth because you're invisible. Fair enough. <laughs> Noise. <laughs> no. Uh. <laughs> Um, you, you are, you are a cat. You're very agile. You do hear things. Um, and Sophie isn't necessarily the quietest walker. She's not used to having to sneak around. Yes, and... under thighs. Just. <laughs> <laughs> you say that to an underage girl. Like, you're so mean. <laughs> no, I don't mean it. <laughs> um, so you do sort of, you're able to keep track of where something is. Yeah, she's just kind of staring at the weird little dust marks getting scuffed and pebbles go in. It's just watching this go and like, oh, okay. You don't necessarily know invisible. that it's her, though, but yeah. I know there's someone invisible there. <laughs> it's uh, in the tree Tammy's in. Does, is her tail hanging down? Can still we try to grab it? 
Tammy? Her tail has probably flicked up if she's noticed oh, yeah. one coming nearby. <laughs> My plans are all in ruin. It was hanging until a few seconds ago. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's like... Brr. Just, yeah, like, curls back up. Hey, you in this tree? Uh, Guys, I don't think she's here. Whoa, what was that? At this point, she's like, Tammy is looking down because she knows this person is coming at her. And she's like, uh, hello? Uh, she's gonna, Sylvie's going to shake you? the tree. She's going to try and shake the tree <laughs> with what little strength she has. Yeah, make me a strength or athletics roll. <laughs> it's like a two-year-old shaking a tree like it's ah! but not doing anything it's like a 300 year old oak <laughs> no chance Lol. yeah that thing is no, not just... budging why why is all my plans why do i always fail at all my plans tammy feels bad and drops a leaf on her as if she as if selfie had shaken it loose I did it. I got <laughs> one lead. I've grown stronger. Yeah. See, we know it yeah, all I mean, fail all the time. Down. Well done. Oh, I mean, if you wanted me to come down, you could have just said so, and she just casually well, hops I down could... about That's a meter I... away from Sophie. <laughs> just did. All right. Um. So I guess Tammy. Uh, were, were you planning to survey the stockades? Most of the day, what what did you have in mind? Please, uh, he no. he wrote your name. What's that? Wait, you I say your thing. Yeah. Uh, well, since she's okay with it, I might go off and get some supplies again. But I do want to keep a eye on him because some he looks like he got pretty messed up by some of those civilians the other day. Well, I'm sure nothing terrible could possibly happen to him with guard supervision. And I, like, like gesture towards, like, I assume at least a couple guards standing watch over him at the stockades. Hey, I'm, a, I'm, an, I'm an antisocial, no idea druid, and I already know you just jinxed it. Please, don't nothing could worry. possibly go wrong. Yes, the guards have... Kept a vigil vigilance over me. It will be fine, I'm sure. I would like to meditate on the decisions I need to make. See, that's the right mindset to have, you know, Senshi. I'm glad you're learning from this experience. There isn't much else to do when I have to hang here all day. Uh, is Senshi looking mostly okay? Or is he but still most, like, it, it'll take him health? Yeah, it'll be up to him. He'll I'll give him a uh, short rest so he could use um, a couple of hit dice if he wants to. But so I don't know. He, he's doing decent. He's closed up. He's not gushing blood. He okay. looks like somebody who's been in a stockade for a day and a night. Yeah. Well, I might. I'm still tired out from last night. I might need a bit of a nap too, if that's all right. But yeah, shopping, nap, and then we'll go from there. Sounds good. We have to go meet uh, Malzahar's uh, teacher. I'm also a leaf what? now. Uh -huh. Sure, congrats! Oops. You'll be keep practicing. You'll be a a animal in no time. <laughs> Don't pity me, Tammy. She's always gonna walk away <laughs> and drop the leaf. I start talking to the leaf on the ground. <laughs> I can tell you all about Baldi to all right. the tutor. All right. This well, one actually, time uh, she beat him with a butter knife. Chris, she didn't beat me with a butter knife. It was barely a sword. It wasn't a sword. Did you see a leaf, Selfie? <laughs> Selfie. And he sort of starts walking after Selfie, because who is, I'm guessing, headed to the market as well. <laughs> uh, no, she she's invisible. She's just walking off in a pout. She just has the backpack, has the icon. Mal still has her backpack. Perfect. Yeah, Mal has the backpack. <laughs> yeah, it's like, yeah. what the hell? Oh. So Selfie has technically just... disappeared. No, she's she right here on the out. ground. Leaf Silphy. Come on, Leaf Silphy. <laughs> is the arena in the city? No, it's an island nearby. 
like you can get there in less than 30 minutes kind of thing by taking a boat okay i think instead of going to my mentor especially if sylphie wants to tag along i'd rather go to the arena and it's possible she's there <laughs> she's also a valid our oh, elf leaf sylphie wait what <laughs> chris yeah, what are you doing there. beautiful amber eyes I like poke the leaf. I'm like, are you listening? I, I do that thing where I grab Chris by the collar and start dragging him away. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. <laughs> where are we going? Shopping? Where are we going? Eh. Uh, where do, you, where do you need to go, Tammy? Uh, um, I don't know in particular, but I, I wanted to sec check some of the other shops around here. Which shop? Uh, what have we got closest to us here? Oh, I'll move you over. Long story right. short, I want to go shopping, but I don't want to make it like no, like she wants to know where she's going right off the bat, because that would be a little fourth wall breaking. Sylvie's gonna follow once they pass her as well, so she's back with the group. Um, so Tammy, you could know, like you've been to this town before, you do know relatively what the shops are and like what they would have, so you can know the store yeah, you want to go to. Her. Well, maybe the uh, uh. uh the bookstore, the theatric store. I haven't been there in a while. I want to see if they got anything new. Well, Tammy, uh, are you are you looking for something, like just to read, or what? What, what are you going there for get, exactly? I think they occasionally get spell books in there. I, I'm. Ah, it's always useful okay. stuff. In that case, uh, yeah, sure. It's just you know, if if it was something more of a leisure visit. I'd say we sh we would pro should probably part ways, but if it's something uh, maybe to help with our uh, treks through the sewers or maybe on adventures, because I assume you'll be joining us, uh, yes, for sure. Let's uh, we could all go. And we're gonna head to uh, Murray's Theatrics then. Beautiful. Is that where I got my books previously? It is. Okay. And that's why I want to go there. <laughs> it's a pretty cool shop. Right. The oh God, yeah. I got the Grothor slays everything, Sailing 101, The Sea and We, which is apparently some romance novel. You can talk about it with Tammy as you guys go there. <laughs> you can yeah, like, I've actually there. been. There. It's, got, it's got some decent books. I'm hoping oh, these uh, will... Which one? What's, what's that one with a critter this on one? it? Yeah. With a critter on it? The Grothor slays everything? Yeah, what's that one about? So it actually, it's quite interesting. You see, and I'll open it to a very gruesome picture of how to kill like certain monsters. You see here, if you decapitate a blah, and oh, real that that's useful. Uh, I was a hoping the druid should be appalled at it. Okay, and I'm trying to find things that'll appall her. Yeah, she's a druid, but she's also part cat. <laughs> she's like, look what I can do, and just that's got a some mouse. <laughs> Murder runs in my yeah, grabbed him on the street, ripped his head off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's kind of uh, sadistic. Oh my god! <laughs> I don't think she actually does this. She's or just, she's like, I mean, look at that. Look, it tells you all about what they're like. And she's ner less nerding about the killing everything and more nerding about animal, animal info. I don't know if it has, like, info that wouldn't be... Like, it's called Grobthor Slays Everything. I guess, Lauren, what, what info would be in it? Uh, it's about the stories of him slaying things. And so as you, like, encounter beasts, like, maybe he's slain them before and he writes down, like, how he did it. Okay, like so, read... like, hunting like a, Yeah, like, like a that. Pokedex. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This beast is harmful to slashing damage and can often take... Ba 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 ba. Watch out for its stinger. Oh, does he rate them like the adventurer system? <laughs> That'd be pretty useful. Creature rating seven. Dude, it's hella <laughs> useful if you get some action to work at it. Yeah. So yeah, we're we're going to the bookstore, man. You guys can make your way there. Uh, as they walk ahead. Okay. Can uh, Sophie use her uh, contact stone to call Amy Chan and see if she's going to be at the arena? Oh, my God. Amazing! Yeah. Oh, God. 
Ah, yes, you can do that. Oh, I thought Marie's theatrics was Miss Choice when I led you guys to 13 earlier. No, Miss Choice is one. Oh, so it's the same area. Okay. Yeah. Um, so Amazon is like, hello? Hi, it's Sophie. Uh, are you going to be at the arena today? Best friend, Sophie! No, I'm over in Harvardton still. Oh. Oh, no. I'm having a bad day. I wanted a duel. Oh, maybe you can duel one of your friends. I guess I could. They seem fearsome. Well, that's all I really wanted. Good luck in Harverton. Goodbye, best friend. <laughs> Goodbye, best friend. Talk to you soon. Have a better day. I won't. And then she oh. hangs up. <laughs> oh. Maybe she'll surprise you. It takes a couple hours. Oh, yeah, dueling Tammy. That'd be funny. <laughs> Cat's wait, wait, wait. Um, Do you want to be following them? Uh, yeah, Sophie's still behind them. Okay, cool. Cat's light. <laughs> Perfect. So you guys can get to Marie's theatrics. You open the door and you see the half elf Murray and his like crooked glasses on his head. Um, some of you have met him before, and he's hustling around, moving yeah, books from shelves and stuff like that. It's a very nice like oak interior of the room, quiet, it's like an old library. Oh, Ooh. good evening. Good afternoon, whatever time it is. Good morning. <laughs> uh, have you got anything much new in lately? Well, we always have the odd book coming in and going out, but what are you looking for? Uh, just magic stuff, I guess. And she, anything that can help, uh, anything can help me with magic, maybe. And and maybe one of those. She points at Grob Thor's lays everything. One of those too. That looks awesome. Perfect. Perfect. Um, do you know what you want to buy? Because I have no idea oh, what well, the yeah. items are. Uh, let me. <laughs> She's gonna settle on. Oh, where, where's my notes? Dang it! I was like, "There's endless okay. spell book." I mean, she's gonna look at that, look at the price, <laughs> and then go, "Nope." Yeah. Uh, she's gonna want Grob Thor slays everything, the can do cantrips, marvelous magics, probably the misspell books because they just one of them has stuff all over it. And it's like, gotta get the set. <laughs> and I have no doubt she's gonna find the mimic book. <laughs> Okay, that was a lot. <laughs> yeah, she pokes the book, the mimic. Wow. Would wow. Sophie have already read any of these, like during her studies? Roll me a d20. Ooh, actually, let's do this. Call high and low. Uh, I'll roll, but call high and lo or low, uh, and then odds or evens. Um, high and even. And then I roll a d20 again. Yeah, I'll do it. Um, so I got low and evens. So you haven't read many of the books in here, but you have always wanted, or your Miss Troy one time got you the Extreme Teen Bible because she thought it would be nice for you. Nice. It, I don't know if I would have read it if it wasn't related to magic. Like, if it was, like, a casual thing that she got. It's got nothing to do with business. <laughs> yeah, it's about the, the deity of teens, and you weren't really into that. I think she would have pretend she read it. <laughs> it's like a kid's magazine, but it's a book. <laughs> all the cool things happening. Um... Tammy, do you know the price of all that stuff? And do you have the list? Um, okay, the Mimic, Can Do, and Marvelous Magics are all 20 each. That's uh, grow up, okay, Can Do, Marvelous Magic, Mimic, that's 20 each. The misspell books were two gold total, because there's one gold each and there's two of them. 
And then there's Grob Thor Slays Everything, which I think was 25 silver? Okay, yeah. Yeah. Two gold for the misspells. 20 silver for Grob Thor. And then... Okay, yeah, basically... Cool. Yeah, so you guys... silver and two gold. <laughs> Mraz is the best. He likes selling yeah. houses for cheap. He's a used bookstore. Anyway, so you guys can walk around, you know, pulling out all of these books and that relate to spells and anything that's interesting. Um, and essentially piles it up. Tiles it. Would you like these um, wrapped in paper at all? Uh, it should be fine. I'm just going to put them in my backpack here. Um, all of the books will weigh between three to five pounds. That's a lot. <laughs> three pounds, we'll say. Just to yeah. have them on your... Mel, same to you. Sophie's gonna buy a kazoo for together. one silver piece. No, no. How does she do that? She's invisible. <laughs> she's gonna just put like she's gonna put the kazoo on the counter and then put a silver piece next to it and then take the kazoo back. I'll be standing there with like just my eyes above the counter, being like, "Who's that fake Sophie? Don't worry about it." <laughs> um, the kazoos are in like a little jar beside the cash too, so it just like lifts up, puts down <laughs> a little silver. That can happen. All right, I'm going to put the books at like one pound each and I've got to add them all in here. Perfect. I thought you said they were three pounds each. It seems heavy for a book. Two pounds total? It is. That's why I was thought. Yeah, one is good. I'm just going to do one pound each so I can list the books separately. Is anybody, anybody else? else shopping around? Chris, as you uh, walk through, you do see like a tiny little disco ball on one of the lower shelves. Hey, little cool. I do a little illusion to do lights and stuff. And it sparkles, sparkles up. The boogie bomb. <laughs> you know about the boogie bomb? Do you know the muffin man? Uh, I'll, I'll, uh, see, so, uh, what is this, Muri's or Greg's? Muri's theatrics, right? Yeah. Uh, yes, the clerk, uh, pointed this out, uh, when I was here earlier, and I, and I, like, gestured that I had, you know, previously bought books here. Uh, apparently it's a boogie bomb. I think you hurl it at people, and they, you know, kind of forget what it does. <laughs> no, whoa, no, it, it's just beers on a ball, man. <laughs> It reflects the light. And I like show it to him. <laughs> <laughs> you can spin it, and, like you, you see. Are you sure it doesn't do anything else? I mean, if you threw it at something, it would hit it probably, but <laughs> that's probably it. Do you know it'd be hilarious if you threw it at Sylvia while she's invisible? How would I do that? <laughs> You just see us kazoo point. in the background, sadly, like, playing a song. Mm. It's just a floating kazoo. You could also try throwing it to, uh... Actually, yeah, throw it and see if Sophie... Or, uh, uh Tammy catches it. Um, Mariah has wandered over as you guys are crouched Damn. down talking about this thing, and he's like, <laughs> Oh! Yep, that's a lovely little thing there! My brother Aster made it! Why am I Mickey? <laughs> okay, he's Mickey now. <laughs> Dope. You gotta tell us if this does anything if we throw it. Oh, I will. Don't show it. Throw it in my shop now. That uh, that there's the boogie bomb. And what does it do? Well, uh, anybody caught within its radius has a irresistible need to dance. How do you get inside this like three inch radius? Oh, oh no! Uh, when you throw it at sixty feet, quite the big bomb, I do say so. Astro's quite good with machinery. This is Don't a bomb. <laughs> well, yeah, that's in the title. Watch him just fat finger drop it. Usually, you have to make things pretty apparent for adventurers. Yeah. Ahoy! Ahoy! Um, Ahoy! I'm just gonna put this down. Well, that's probably a good idea. We haven't deactivated it until it's purchased, but, you know, don't throw bombs. It's always a good bet. Oh, it's deactivated and I hurl it at the sand. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. 
Merlin at what? The sad harmonica. <laughs> <laughs> Sophie's gonna fail that roll. She's not even gonna roll. Just gonna hit it, Sophie. Woof. Well, let's. <laughs> Why would you actually throw it? I feel it's like it's activated. I feel, I feel like Chris, Chris is, I, isn't good at throwing things. I don't so, think I am either. So you, so should, you should roll. roll. With disadvantage? What do you want me to roll? Is it an attack roll? It's an attack with an improvised ranged weapon. What's the range on it? I mean, however you can throw. Wait, why would you have dex for an unarmed ranged weapon? Because it's ranged. It's yeah, ranged fine. uses dex. Yeah. Oh, he uses dex? Oh, yeah, oh, you big meathead. <laughs> Throwing it would not improve the situation. <laughs> With strength. Um, um, you definitely miss Sophie. Um, it whiffs by the harmonica uh, into a couple of the scrolls and, and bookshelves behind it, and you start hearing like a tick, 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 tick from, from within the books. I think I hear her feet tapping. She must be boogie. Uh, does does Sophie uh, realize what's happening right now? Well, uh, quickly, very quickly, uh, at this, Mariah's gonna go, Oh no, we've activated! Get out quickly! Spread the word! Everybody go! Go! <laughs> so he's like, run. <laughs> run for your lives! <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, why? Why would we need to? Is it just makes us want to dance, right? An irresistible urge to dance can be a terrible thing. This <laughs> huge <laughs> fireball starts erupting from the <laughs> corner of the room. Okay, you, you start... have to survive the explosion first. Chris, where are you? Like, are you running? Are you like, doing? if he's saying run, There's I'd be like, <laughs> what? You said it was deactivated. <laughs> Slow motion uh, jump. <laughs> Team Rocket's blasting up again. <laughs> yeah, Murray's running towards the bookshelf where it had embedded itself. Jump on it, Sylvie. Take one for the team. <laughs> Sylvie's gone. <laughs> How would we know? Our, well, the our hair. The kazoo went out the door. Yeah, she moved. You stole Jim. the kazoo? I paid for the kazoo. She did pay for it. Oh, okay. I didn't know she had bought the kazoo. I'm like, she just stole a kazoo. So yeah, we all run. Running. So as you, as you probably caught like a deer in the headlights going <laughs> between the bomb and her friends. Oh yeah, sixty feet. But it, can it go through walls, or would it be contained in the store? You'll have to find out. I'll run out. I probably wouldn't run like a full sixty feet though. I'd run outside the store. I'd be like, huh. Yeah, how and far away is outside? If, if the store blows, like I'm maybe like ten, twenty feet from the door at this point, probably. Yeah, about that. Uh, so, Tammy, are you running or not? No, oh, she's gonna finally just cuss out Chris, like damn it, Chris, and go and help. Yeah, Murray has moved to the bookshelf and seems to be fiddling with um, the boogie bong that is now lighting up in odd colors, and he's like punching the colors and stuff to it too. Help. No, we just gotta no, just gotta get in the sequence before it erupts. Hurry, get out, get out. Oh, okay, and she's out. <laughs> That's Grace or whatever it was. It she is out. And you all like duck down, yelling. People are running around, being like, "What's going? What's going on?" Almost Mickey. Apparently, there's a bomb. The boogie bomb. <laughs> Cover your ears. <laughs> People are lunging behind storefronts, barrels, tables are up flipped. Women and children, save them. <laughs> and as the streets go quiet, waiting for the bomb to erupt. Time oh, no. clicks away. away. That was a weird bomb noise. <laughs> and nothing comes from within. Okay. And then Murray comes out hand in the air with the boogie bomb disarmed. And he's like, oh, I've got it, everybody. It's all safe and clear. Goose attacks, he drops it, goes off. <laughs> Everyone dances. <laughs> you cry of relief from Tammy, and then she's going to turn hackles up to Chris. Chris? Well, did she see Chris do it? 
Oh, you're standing right there. He told yeah. me to do it. No, but did Tammy see Chris do it? She was standing right there, like, buying books. She was up her purchases. Yeah, Marie so had probably it. Yeah, I'd, I'd give Pardon? her to that. I'd say yes. All right. Okay. It's okay. It's harmless. Do you not like the dance? I don't like the fact that you seem to never consider consequences. And she is full on cat glare, killer cat glare, staring him down. I don't think she likes to dance. That's it? When yeah, she just she hits his and like turns around and storms off. And th then stops because she realizes she's going to leave her friends behind if she does that. I don't think she likes you, Chris. I don't think she likes dancing. No one doesn't like, like irresponsible idiots! She definitely doesn't like you, Chris. It could be. I did blame her for burning Harberton with the Camara, you know, working with... What's his name? Charlie? Wait. Did you say blame her? Yeah, you don't remember? We thought that she like rode the Camara here or something. Oh, don't remember wait, that. What? But she might have been part of that conspiracy. Uh, private conversation, Tammy. <laughs> I'm not far enough away. Yeah, but I, I would, I would be like, shoo. <laughs> Oh, she's just gonna hand on him and stare at both of I think she's eavesdropping on us, Chris. Did I tell you about this? What, what happened. Yeah, yeah, you convinced me of it. Way back. I don't remember if we ever resolved it. But you yeah. had me wholly convinced. Yeah, 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 and you guys were supposed to watch Tammy. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I let it go. I thought she was clean. Are you suspicious? Because she's angry? Oh, I like glare back at her. <laughs> I feel like this should be an opposed intimidation check. <laughs> oh, you don't want to do that with Chris. Yeah. <laughs> My role's not amazing for that one. I don't know if I'd be trying to intimidate, though. It's fine. No inter-roles between characters. I know. It's more for funny than anything, but yeah, oh, yeah. No, she's just straight out death glare. I just suspicion. I'm like, what? Well, uh, if we're done with uh, Murray's theatrics, uh, did anybody have anything else you need to grab in the city before? Uh, I know I wanted to leave the city for a little bit today. Yeah, we're going to go see Maladeen. Oh, well, actually, I decided uh, instead of that, because Sophie wants to tag along, um, and I probably wouldn't get much training done, I figured I'd check uh, what the postings are like at the arena. You would See get a lot maybe of training I can get done. a fight. You would get a lot of training. Can I have my backpack back, by the way? She's going to try yeah, to take her back. Here you go. Yeah, I would give her her backpack. I don't mind. Yeah, it's backpack, Sylvie. But if we if we went and met your instructor or tutor or whoever, he could teach you about uh, mage fighting, and I could be the mage for the fighting. It's a she. Oh. I guess I could always help, too, if you need me to. This is the perfect opportunity. You have mage mage people here, and you can learn to battle mage people. Well, maybe you guys can uh, f sign up for some fights in the arena as well. It's a great way to make some extra coin. My mom says I'm not allowed to Money? do that anymore. Anymore? Anymore. What happened? I She doesn't like it when I battle things. Does that mean... Like, you have to fight people, or does that include when you just support them? Because if you've got, like, healing spells or something, and we... And there was, like, a team-up or something... There's no healing there's... in the arena. Team would be cool. There is there is team battles in the arena. Um, okay, usually let's... it would be... Let's do a team battle. I want to do it oh. now. Uh, t... We could do two on two. Although I'm not much of a what? fighter. I'm more of a lover. <laughs> I guess we could. Uh, yeah, you get. Yeah, well, good for you. Uh, the only thing is, like, do they have any ways, like, just in case it gets 
a little too far because magic uh, can be pretty powerful. They they do. Uh, I was beaten to a pulp by uh, Amisan and on the verge of death, and they brought me back. Okay. Yeah, and Chris and Mal's, you guys fought in the arena during like the initial trial, and they explained that yeah. there's doctors in there. Yeah. So like, you don't have to hold back. Don't you can go. Why would you go back in the arena? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like a, it's, it's a feat of strength or willpower or whatever. It's, it's time to show off what you got. That could be useful. It's a practice thing, couldn't it? Hazard loves it. He's like an adrenaline junkie. I live for the closest of a blade. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you're all agreed to go to the arena. PvP time. Yeah, this Yay. is awesome. So I'm gonna like fast track yeah. this there. Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, oh, nice! It's my music when I fought my teacher. Yeah, that's the starting music for this music. song. Oh, I see Chris in the stand still. I'm turning yeah. this up. Oh, right, here we go. I'm in a couple spots. I only see you once. Okay. So, who wants to be on whose team? I think we should uh, roll for it. Stop. Yeah, I'm down with rolling for teams. If if we're gonna do it like this, are we putting money on it? Oh. I think we should put money on it. I want to be on Ma I want to be on Malzahar's team. I thought oh. you weren't allowed to participate, Sammy. Selfie. Or I mean, uh, Sylphie? Yeah, but no, I really want to. I'm <laughs> Today's today's a day of failures, so what's another one? I don't be on Sylvie's team. You can't even see her. How are you gonna beat her? <laughs> She's I would assume entering the arena, I assume they would have dis like if she wants to fight, they would probably just make her dispel that. Yeah, I'd agree Isn't with that. Right? Like this yeah. isn't just like we could go in and it's like a hockey rink and it's like, oh yeah, no one's using the ice. Go ahead, bud. Just jump down there. No. <laughs> Yeah, you had oh, to go and like get permission. You have to sign waivers and shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, there's a lot of dangerous words in this disclaimer. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Same thing for signing up for life and death trials. Uh, well, ooh, how about right. we do a mock four-way battle? Oh God. I like two and two. two. I don't know who that is. I was wondering if I wanted to do like really jackass, like I'll 1v3 them. <laughs> like as the pro of the arena guy. Can I get home field advantage? <laughs> I could always see what monsters I have prepped. I would say that'd be a good idea for a team battle, us versus a monster. Uh, uh, is, there a, is there a purse, depending on what monster we fight as well? Like, cause obviously like. For entertainment I don't value. For free. That could be practice fight, unless we're going right into the business. I'd say, if, I'd say if you want to set up some stuff for the arena, like we could do team battles versus like set list of monsters, and there's like a higher prize depending on the monster we pick. But for now, like a two v two would probably be best and easier for you to set up than having to find like a CR rating of some kind. I don't know. I'm fine with anything. Yeah. I'm just excited to be in an arena. I'm yeah, excited to actually fight as a fighter, you know? That's a, it's a real nice feeling. Yeah, let's do a two-on-two -two right now, just because the monster that I have is, um, I think, a little too weak to go on all four of you, because I didn't have him to be just a V1. That's fair. Um, so let's all roll D6s. All right. <laughs> All right, Tammy and Mal's, Chris and Sophie. All right. We got this, and I go for a high five in the wrong direction. Oh, and she's not invisible anymore. <laughs> we slap hands. All right. So how does this guys... work? Do we have like time to strategize, or just go in for it? I'll give well... you guys time to strategize. <laughs> Tammy, tell yeah. you what, you yeah. focus on Sylphie, I'll tangle Chris up. If you can yeah, take Sylphie okay. down before I'm done with Chris, help me out with Chris. Okay, that's good. And I'll try and keep you healed up, but you gotta 
I'm kind of squishy, so if I start getting a lot of fire, you gotta help me out, okay? Try to worry more about you. Okay, okay. Me and Sylvia. By the got way, it. I would have taken my bag off for this. I assumed there'd be like a, a room oh, God, before no. we enter the yeah. arena. I could have my bag off. So yeah, everybody can go ahead and have like whatever equipment you want to have on. On. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Why do I not have my dark? Chris, what's in my what's attack? what spells do you have that we can use today? Well, I'm not really much of a fighter. <laughs> I can distract people really well. I'm like. Bleh, 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 bleh. <laughs> Oh, oh no. I'm well, like, uh... should we be stretching like them? And I see like Mal's like <laughs> getting ready to fight. Oh yeah, I'm limbering <laughs> up. I've, I've like got my twin blade out. I'm doing some twirls. I do a backflip real quick. Oh uh, yeah. You think oh, they're yeah, gonna put like the juices. pool noodles or something on his blades? <laughs> Tammy's stretching a bit and doing like a bit of random magic, like little, bringing like, little sparkly fires and stuff out. Do we want to roll initiatives now, or...? Yeah, does Selfie and... Is like that all you guys want to do for fun? Uh, try to... If you have anything that can keep Maldahar away from us, that would be good. But we need to get rid of the cat. Um, actually, do you guys want to do this? Do you want me to separate you guys into different rooms so you can get, like, five minutes? I'm... I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm good. Do we oh, go to oh. either side of the arena, or are we just starting where we are? Uh, you, uh, you can go to either I, side I would of the say arena. start, like, adjacent to us. The then... wall, you're gonna be all the way at the... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I, assume, I assume we're, like, huddled in the corner. <laughs> Feel okay. free to roll an issue. She's trying to, like, okay. strategize oh, with us. Oh, there's the cat. If you can give me any kind of buff, Tammy, to uh, get in there quickly, that would be great. Okay. Actually, yeah. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> Silphy. Come on. Oh, sorry, you guys are going to kick the shit out of them. It's going to be cool. <laughs> I think you want yes. this. <laughs> All right. Either tie them up or buff me, and I'm going to just rain hell on them. Okay, I'll, I'll see if I can't keep Silphy off your back. Ready to go. And I'm gonna wait for the announcer to tell us to go, I guess. Perfect. A big loud, like a coo -doo signals the start of the battle. I raise my hands as the, as the, like, and I'm trying to, like, pump up the crowd. I'm doing, like, come on! <sighs> oh, there's actually people. Nice. Woohoo! <laughs> Woo sure. Tammy's kind of getting into it and, like, waving and then doing, like, little fire spells, too. As I'm spinning my twin blade, can some sand start like catching in the wind around the spin blade? So it looks like really cool. Sure. Ooh, Got a little make, dust tornado brewing. Make a performance. I'm okay with that. I'll let you eyes, guys. Everybody can do one thing to instigate the crowd. You hear a loud cheer for Mouses. Can Sophie just cast mage armor on herself because she doesn't care about the crowd? <laughs> yes. I'm like, oh wow, that's cool. Uh, I big like dunk as armor like sits down on you, buffing you up. Oh, you little. All right, that's it. We have to go. Um, Chris, are you gonna do anything to instigate the crowd? No. I'm trying to like suss out the situation still. What was that noise? What do you mean the situation? <laughs> you're the Chris. He rolled wide, he doesn't even know what's happening. That's <laughs> yes, true. Alright, begin. Nothing personal. She yells and she's gonna cast call Call Lightning what? on Sophie. We're just starting off strong here. Uh, Sophie uses a reaction to cast Absorb Elements. It's gonna be a good fight! Oh god. So, uh, yeah, the damage is, is, uh, is oh half. Shit, I'm both of them! <laughs> so yeah, um, her damage is halved, and she- and you see her quarter staff like, surge up with electricity. 
All right, Ready? you guys gotta do uh, deck saving throws. Yeah, both of you. Oh, I don't think I have advantage on dex ones, so I'll fail. Okay. Sophie, you can go ahead, or do you just automatically? No, it's just a reaction to whatever damage I take. Okay. You guys both failed that, so... Hold on, what do I roll here? Probably 1d10. Uh, 1d10, yeah. Nope, it's 3d10. Oh, up there. Oh, you cast it at a higher level, or...? Um, you should be able to... Oh, creature takes 3d10 lightning damage. You should be able to save. cast this ex from your character sheet, like, on the first page, and it'll do an attack. If it's in right. She could or also just roll 3d10, 3D 10, yeah. Yeah, I already... Yeah, I think I already cast it. We just, just need not... the damage dice. No, no, no. Yeah. yeah, the damage. Alright, so I'll just it's do like 3d10 here. Yeah. Yeah. And then what is oh, Sophie going to do? And then Except Sophie takes off the six, yeah, six damage to add to her next attack. Um, but both of you will take 25 and... No, she 19. takes half damage as well. Is it half? It absorbs uh, half the damage. Okay. And then, yeah, that's fair. And I also have resistance to that for the remainder. So the lightning, yeah. Till your next turn. Yeah, till the next turn. Perfect. I look like so I just got electrocuted. <laughs> <laughs> half a 25. Am I, am I rounding down or rounding up? Round down. Okay. Alright. Alright, so, Miles, you're up. Miles is gonna run 30 feet towards them because that's all I can do, really. So, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, here. Um, remember to, uh, since we're doing a battle and we haven't done it in a while, let's try to say everything we want to do and then, like, do our roles and do everything. Right. Oh, okay. okay. Just yeah, she's gonna so, hold the position for now. So, the plan is for Miles. So, I, I'm running in to get in range and then seeing. I don't know why I can see Chris's health. I guess because we're in a party, but obviously because I want to throw off Chris mainly, I'm going to uh, throw a once I get in range, I'm throwing a kunai at him or a dagger that being said I don't remember what you gave me for what the damage were on them because I don't have it on my um, on my sheet. It would just be a regular dagger daggers are 1d4 yeah, yeah. okay so 1d4 is it plus my dex? I assume yes. If you're, if you're proficient. proficient. Yes. Okay. Yeah, he's proficient with all weapons. Yeah. Okay, so I would... So I run up, which is here. And then I throw the kunai at Chris. Well, I throw the first kunai at Chris. Ooh, it might be a disadvantage. Yeah, I'm pretty far for a dagger. Think. Is it not? It's 30, I think it's 30, 30 60. 60. Yeah. 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 Okay, okay, so I'll roll again then. One sec. I'll just roll the attack again. For 10, so yeah, that one probably misses. Whoa, whoa! Okay, I'll throw another one. This time I'll do it at <laughs> disadvantage again. Just gonna keep you off your feet. 13? Um, that is my AC. Is it me to beat? Is it odds or evens? What do you do? Let's I have do it, we haven't done combat in so long. Yeah, and, and not against each other either. either. Yeah. I call odds. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. Uh, Maus, do you want to roll a d4? Nah, I'm okay. good. Okay, I'll do it. Even Stevens, even Stevens, even Stevens. Odd. Damn it. All right, oh, so they both miss. Whoa. Uh -oh. Okay. Um, I think I only have two attack actions, so that is my... Turn. Perfect, Sophie. All these daggers are whipping past Chris. You guys just got electrocuted. So Sophie is going to use her 30 feet of movement to go down along the back wall of the arena. And then once she's as far as she can go, she's going to cast Call Chaos in the middle of, uh, of Tammy and Malzahar. Like in between them. Okay, yeah, like there. And then she's going to heighten the spell to force disadvantage on Tammy. Okay. Is there a roll on that one? 
Yeah, go ahead. Uh, she it. makes a dex save at disadvantage. Just her or both? Uh, only, only Tammy makes the dex save at disadvantage, but Melt also has to make a dex save with just regular. What's the DC? Throw it in. Yeah, the, the spell. My spell to see uh, is... Oh, I also have to roll Ooh. Wild Magic Nine. for my, my mage armor. I guess I missed that, though, so... <laughs> We'll just not do that. I definitely dodged some magic. Oof, yeah, she <laughs> failed. Oh, that that doesn't have a cast. That's it's that was damage. just me clicking the spell. That's the yeah. damage, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's the damage? Oh, okay. Oh, no, it is actually oh, the no, attack no, no, that's just or the, the roll. That is the roll, oh, yeah. That is there's no, there's no roll, though. It's that's just damage, placed yeah, in the middle. Yeah. No, the damage okay. is when I click it. Yeah, mm, when you... Well, I yeah. click the... It's, it's sure the things. So what's your DC? <laughs> uh, my spell DC is 15. Oh, shit. oh, here it is. Yeah, now I opened it. Are you safe, I guess? Or is and that odd even? 15 against a spell, I think, goes to the dodger. Um, but you still take half damage on a success. But Mal's, because you crit, you won't. You were able Sweet. to fully dodge I'm it. I'm okay with this. Um, and then, so roll your damage, Sophie. I have to roll the damage type, too. Yeah. And wild magic after that. I think it says eight for call chaos or something. No, it's because it's set up weird as a spell attack kind of thing when it shouldn't be because it does. So damage it's to poison this. damage and it will do uh Fuck. twenty-eight damage to well, it'll do half that to Tammy. Okay, so fourteen. <laughs> All right. So you cast a spell and now you get knocked back by your, uh, another one. And then, Chris, you're up. Uh, I still gotta roll my wild magic to see if oh, anything happens. That's true. Oh my god, please self implode. <laughs> oh god. Someone on black hole on top of yourself. <laughs> I like that she moved. That's good. Uh, <laughs> okay, I'm just, I was just checking them out. Oh wait, no, that was the wrong thing I need to roll d20. Oh, that's a wild magic oh. with an 88, so what is an 88? <laughs> big bucks and whammies, big bucks and whammies. You cast fly on a random creature <gasps> within 60 feet of you. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> That could be oh bad. God, only me and Chris? No, that could be really good for you though. Fuck! If it gets on me, it's gonna be it's gonna be bad. But there's a thing I wanna ask about that. Does the crowd count as creatures within sixty feet? <laughs> Some dude's like, whoa! That's, that's true. <laughs> um, that is true. However, I'll say no, there's a magical sphere to keep spells and shit like outside mm. of the crowd, um, for safety reasons. Yeah, that makes and sense. I rolled and it's Chris. That's fucked! Yeah, I rolled a three and I had to sign. So Chris can now fly. <laughs> that's fucked. <laughs> that, okay. that changed the game for him, at least. Is it concentration it's... by anybody? No, with this no wild no? magic. He's just, just, he just, he just able, gets effect. He's, he's just gone. Able to okay. I get 60 feet of movement now, too, right? Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, whatever, whatever the fly. That just that busted was. the entire fight. <laughs> We're gonna have to have reaction about this. Uh. Hey, Chris. And with that, it's Chris's turn. Yeah. And I start floating up, like, whoa. whoa all right, all right, all right. And I, like, zoom. Um, I'm and gonna I'm fly. Like, what the? I'm gonna fly up, but I'm gonna be. Um, I'll say. Right above me? Yeah. I don't know how high I can get there, but we'll say at least 40 feet up. Can you move that far? Because that alone is a certain distance thing. You can go 40 feet up. Like in a diagonal line going up. Yeah, so the diagonal line, I probably could get 50 feet up, I think. Okay. Or, or was I there? 40 feet? That's why I'm just saying I'll go. Uh, let's uh, let's say 20, 20 feet just to give it. I don't want to be 20 feet. It would be a chance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't remember my math, so... We'll say 20 because there's an angle of 40, 60 feet. Who's good at math? 
the hypotenuse is less. The hypotenuse is less than both of them combined. It so would probably be 60 feet 40. above him if I moved 60 feet, 40 feet from here. No, it should be the shortest. So if you move forward, less than that. Yeah, the height above me yeah. would be the shortest side. Yeah. Like, we're not worried about the hypotenuse. We're actually trying to find, like, if we're looking at A squared equals B squared, or A, play, A, squared, A squared, plus squared plus B squared, squared equals C squared. C squared. That's, see, that's B squared. We want A squared, which is the other one over here. Yeah. Just fly up we don't, 60 feet where you are. <laughs> yeah, don't we, we don't know where any of this shit. Yeah, if you just fly straight up 60 feet, that makes sense. But if you fly over me, you're, like, moving in a direction as well as going up. So... Yeah, so I would say this is like 25 feet here. <laughs> sure. I got 25 feet above him. Why are you above me? I'm, I'm curious. You're about, about to find, to find out. out. I'm gonna poop on you. <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> no. Welcome to the arena. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Flying is a new development. Yeah, it's kind of a, it. Oh, well, I know what to do now, at least. Um, yeah, I think I'll do hideous laughter. Why not? I'll do it on Mal's. What's the DC? Or what's this? Is it? Do I get a save? I assume. Yeah, wisdom. Oh, that's not good. No. Yeah, that's really not good. What was the DC? I assume 15? 15. 15, yeah. So I am rolling on the floor laughing, I assume? Yep. You're oh, fall. Everything's funny. funny. Just picture Superman gnome, and Malzar is just like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> it's like, this development is just beyond insane. I don't have the laughter, unfortunately, right now. That's fair. Because I'm mad at the situation. <laughs> this is bullshit. <laughs> the most RNG bullshit that could happen happened. And, uh, Unlucky. Yeah. I was horrified that you were going to be the one to fly. <laughs> well, yeah, if I fly, you, oh, you guys are hundo fucked. The fact that anybody got fly was fucked. Uh, well, you still got him? No! <laughs> yeah, is there anything, <laughs> anything else you can do, Chris? Uh, possibly. Let me see. Oh, oh. I already cast a spell, so I can't do that. And you probably used up all your movement getting up there. Tammy, you could dispel magic. I can use my bardic I inspiration. Think. Actually, what spells do you have? Kind of weird. Uh, Tammy's basically asking you, do you still got this? He's just laughing. I'm, I don't think you understand. I can't answer. You also can't ask what spell she has right now. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, but I assume she would have told me at the beginning, like, when we were talking strategy. No, I probably wouldn't. I'd have an wouldn't. idea of her spells. I probably wouldn't have. I would have forgotten that. We yeah. didn't say it. We didn't say it. I'm so just basically Tammy is yelling across the arena. Do you still have? He's rolling around laughing. <laughs> I'm gonna use my mantle of inspiration. Um, I, my wondrous appearance is gonna be straight up like a Superman costume. Instead of an S, I've got like a cog wheel or something. I'm assuming um, not. Me and Sylphie will have five temporary hit points each. Um, and we can use our reaction if we choose. I think Sylphie's already used hers, and we can move up to our speed again. That'll that'll let me do it next uh, next turn, because it resets once it goes back to Tammy. The reaction. Yeah, this is immediate though. You don't it, yeah. you don't get to hold on to this reaction. Oh, okay. Um, but I'll use that movement and I'll fly up as high as it lets me go. <laughs> so that's another sixty feet. Sure. So I'm 85 in the air now. <laughs> okay, please remember that. <laughs> All right, <Yeah>. Tammy, <laughs> you are up. Uh, I'm gonna assume you don't. Sorry, change of plans. And she is going to use that call lightning spell, which is still in effect because it's a concentration spell, I believe. This is uh, why I flew above Malzar. <laughs> 
It's Are you seriously about to cast that on top of it? <laughs> you automatically get crit. <laughs> Are yeah. you serious right now? You're incapacitated. <laughs> yeah, um, here's the reason why, though. Um, I'm first, just gonna that back up. you will have to roll to keep your concentration because you did take damage. Here's she did? A point you can see oh. within range. That does not have to be a point on the ground. Lightning goes from the ground up, though. A bolt of lightning flashes down from the cloud to that point. Plus, it's magic, so... I'm gonna magic, not science. Okay, first uh, you have to roll to keep your concentration, so roll a d10 or d20, sorry. All right. The Sylphy did damage you, so you rolled, so you're fine. Okay. So I guess I roll three more d. Well, what he... was it? Three d10. Chris gets a dex save. Yeah. I have an inspiration, so I might have to use it. No, I'm okay. You get the save. Uh, I'm also. I have to do that too, right? Uh, I think it's outside because if if she's doing it 85 feet in the air or like above Chris Try and not. trying not to hit Mal's, it won't hit you. Yeah, it does take yeah, half damage still right now. Yeah, it would. It only I affects to, things to. within five feet of the of the target. Like it has a little radius. She wouldn't be affected by it. She's under the storm cloud, but not where the lightning bolt hits. Yeah. Yeah. No, if... okay. Go ahead. Because that was a spell from last turn, I should still be able to do a spell this turn? No. If you, if you continue the concentration, that is using the yeah. action to continue the concentration. Okay, no, she uses the action to call lightning, is what it is. She doesn't yeah. Yeah. conjure the cloud again, but you use your action to pull the lightning down again. Um, yeah. So Tammy oh, rolled the three d ten for damage, and Chris will take I just half. Did. It was a oh, twenty-one. The twenty-one. There it is. Okay. So ten for Chris. Roll for concentration, you fucker. You laugh. You make <laughs> me laugh, you fucker. Um, I had five temporary hit points. Okay. Is, is Tammy fighting Malzahar? <laughs> oh, no. Um, no, it's me and Tammy versus Chris and Sylphie. But Chris got real fucking lucky, and he can fly now. Yeah. My wild magic gave it to him. I'm going to use my inspiration. Oh, okay. So roll again? Or What's the con save for? Uh, What's the DC? The 10. 10. Uh, 10. Okay, so yeah. Yeah. So the six. con save is for my concentration on hideous laughter. Oh, okay. So are you done, Tammy? Yeah, I think that's all she can do unless she wants gonna, to move. I'm moving up against the wall here. Uh, and I can't do any additional spells, so yeah, I'm kind of fucked right now. Go ahead. All right, Mal, you are up, but you are laughing. I think you get a save. Yeah, I get a save at the yeah. end of turn. Yeah, yeah. So end of the turn though. Again. So even yeah, if he makes, yeah. he can't do anything. Oh, snap. Wow, thank you, Jeebus. Wow. All right. God damn, buddy. Noise. <gasps> that is your second Which crit. <laughs> that wasn't fuzzy, Chris! <laughs> I'm As I'm rocketing I'm across the sky. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. That's the end of my turn. Perfect. Sophie, you're up. So... <laughs> you're just peeking up. You just want to peek above me, Chris? <laughs> I am above you. <laughs> uh, Sophie shit. is going to uh, cast Call Chaos on top of Melzahar's head. Okay. Boom. He has I'm to make prone, uh, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 You, you automatically fail, Dex. Save? Nope. Yeah. Uh, that roll doesn't do anything. Okay. Let's see. Roll the damage. 26, 26 and let me see the damage really quick. Two, I think it's poison again, isn't it? That was the same uh, as last time. Oh yeah, two it should be two would be cold damage. The last time you rolled two and it was poison. Oh no, because I, I rolled the thing separately. I forgot that I added it to the macro, oh, so I took okay. the first one. 
26. So I'm down to 34, I think. And I got to roll wild magic again. That's terrifying. Yeah, yeah give Chris, give Chris <laughs> mage armor. No, give uh, Chris something else. They yeah. would stack if I gave him anything else. Yeah. yeah. yeah Flame know. sword would be sweet. <laughs> oh my god. Just meteor showers the arena, like. Oh my god, that'd kill me too. The meteorite would hit me, then Mal's. <laughs> I'm like, I'm taking you with me. <laughs> All right, Chris, you are up. What are you up to? Um. I don't know, I see Malzahar like ridding himself, and I am going to go invisible. I'm just going to check the range on this. It's touch, so okay. I'm going to go invisible. <laughs> As I just fade into nothing. And I, I'll move around, but I'll keep my positioning. Invisible. Yeah, we don't know where you are, essentially, but you should tell Lauren. You yeah, should whisper her and tell her. Yeah. Perfect, that's everything you'd like to do? Yeah. Yeah, I use my action to go invisible. <laughs> oh, no. All right. Perfect. All right, Tammy, you are up. You saw the figure of Chris fade away. Sophie's far on the other side. What are you up to? Oh, shit. Uh, Can you call lightning on Sylphie? Yeah, but I'm also... Why is my health where... That my health is just lower. Okay, one sec. Uh, uh, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna call lightning on Sylphie. Sylphie will reaction with absorb elements again. Is that a spell, or is that just something you have? It's a reaction first level spell. Okay. Well, that's kind of shitty. Well, no, you're making her waste first level spell slots. It's fine. You've not, your, your action economy is going fantastically considering how many spell slots you're making or use. with that I also have to do another wild magic roll. Yeah, and then yeah. roll your deck save. Yeah, deck yep. save as well. I'll do uh, deck save first and then wild magic. Cool. Wait, no, the deck save I mean the wild magic roll could affect it. Save. That's true, yeah, do the wild magic oh, first because it yeah. would happen first. Yeah, yeah. Maybe you turn into a pumpkin. I could turn into a flower pot. That is possible. <laughs> She, I think she should automatically fail the deck save if she turns into a flower pot. I would give that, yeah. Oh no, I I, I die if you take if you if you hit the flower pot, I instantly die. She just <laughs> shatter. Oh, oh no. boy. <laughs> Let's see what it is. Flower pot! Flower pot! Nine. You cast magic missiles as a fifth level spell. Bye bye, Melzahar. <laughs> Wait, Ouch. does she get to target me with it too? I can target whatever I want with yeah, magic missiles because it doesn't miss. This is actually insane and that she gets beneficial things with this wild magic every time. It's not every time. Oh, She's failed a lot. Like, yeah. She this is the first time it's actually helped me out of <laughs> the arena. This is it's oh all coming God. to me now. How many magic missiles in a fifth level? Five? It's oh, unbelievable. Yeah. I probably die. Well, they're all 1d4 plus one or whatever. So it's only going to be like 20 some damage if it's max. But I think it's five, at least. It might be seven. It's one it, it, more I dart for every level above first. So as a fifth level, that means... Uh, I think it does three to start. It does three, so it'll do seven. Uh, seven. One D4 plus one force damage for each bolt. All right. All right. <laughs> She's a fucking machine gun with these wild surges. <laughs> seven D4 plus seven, Joy. Yeah, do you want to roll that? Uh, I'm, I'm. If you want to roll it really quick, Lauren, that'd be fine. No, let Tammy roll it. She's got bad rolls tonight. Or not Tammy. I mean Sylphie. Okay, so yeah. uh, what mean, was it? Seven. seven D4 plus what's one? the macro for that going to be? Just type slash R. So uh, yeah. Oh, there okay. There we go. Oh, one each. Oh, no, plus seven. Six. Yeah. So yeah. So it'd be uh, 
So yeah, another six. Yeah, 22. 23. 22. We're going to go with 22 because it's less than 23. Okay, so I'm very low, I think. Oh, yeah, 22. Yeah, it'd be 22 because there is the one. Okay, I think. There we go. That is my current health. I've got to still make oh. my deck save. <laughs> yeah, and then make your deck save. So all of a sudden, yeah, Tammy ca calls down lightning on Sylphie. Sylphie, in a blinding light of thunder, <laughs> shoots Just... mouths with like seven missiles. <laughs> I like, I like to imagine. I like to imagine it's like an avatar when they catch the lightning and then they shoot it out of their hand. Oh my god! <laughs> it's just it's just your heart. Yeah. She like channels it and <laughs> shoots it at Mal's. We see Mal's a skeleton for a second because she doesn't channel the wild yeah. magic. I think it just bursts from her. Well, she well, the, used her reaction to absorb it. I absorbed it, and I made the deck Can save, and it still has. Target with the yeah. head. Would it be fair that she could target with the wild magic or being wild magic? No, should it the be wild random? magic. So uh, you can 100% target me. That's not the problem. I just think she shouldn't get a cool animation doing it. Some some <laughs> don't let me target, like the fly one, but others let me target. It's like all RNG. Like magic missiles yeah. just lets me cast a spell. Yeah, That's anything that hand. says, there's a bunch that say like you cast, which allows her to actually cast the spell. Yeah, that's crazy. It, it just is. surges through her. So, sometimes it causes death, though. So like. <laughs> okay. Uh, nine divided by two. Would I, I take the lower one again, right? So four. Yeah. Yeah. She also has a really hard time casting magic in a non-combat environment because of this. Oh, yeah. magic missile! Everybody in this tavern's dead. <laughs> Still be no guy. fighting. Oh, wait. My my temp hit points. I only take one. <laughs> Woo! All oh, five. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, there go, there go my five. Okay, after that turn. <laughs> Miles, you're up. <laughs> you're just I, breathing. Does it, it takes half my movement to stand up, I assume? Yeah. Okay, how far is she right now? Okay, that's doable. All right, so this is going to be a turn of many things. Is action surge a bonus action or just a free action? It's a free action. It's a choice. All right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be running up towards Sylphie, because I don't know where Chris is. I have zero idea where he is. So it's fine. I have to focus on someone. <laughs> Sylphie's it. So I run 15 feet. I action surge to run again to corner Sylphie. Um, and so that's just a free action. And then I'm going to start. Honestly, Sylphie, I don't like you right now. So I'm just going <laughs> to fucking try to hit you in the fucking face. Yeah, let's do that, shall we? Uh, it's like a British second. backhand. And sure is yeah. second win a bonus action, or is second win also a free action? That is a bonus. I think it's a bonus. Yeah, okay. So we'll take my first attack uh, with Twin Blade. Oh, it misses terribly. Yeah, that Second attack hit. Yeah. with my Twin Blade. You're shaken by the magic missiles. That fucking That hits. hits. Okay. Um, I'm also going to use a superiority die. Because I get to hit you now, Sylphie. Oh. <laughs> and I'm going to go with... What does this one do again? No, that's useless. All right, we're going to go with menacing attack. So first I'll roll the damage, and I'm going to add a d8 to it. So 10 slashing damage plus slash r1d8. Plus another six, so 16 damage uh, on Sylphie. And then, uh, so you have to, where is it? Oh, no, I damage. And target must take a wisdom save. saving throw on a fail save. I don't know why it says spelled save DC zero. I don't know what, what the actual DC on this is uh, on my distracting strike. I don't yeah, know it how it's calculated. It should have said somewhere. You set this up. Let's I don't see, even know. Let's see if I can Google it. Distracting. How to determine DC? No. Uh, Battle Master maneuvers. I think I, I make. I was like, it's okay. Though. She saves. Yeah. Okay. So she saves from that. Okay. 
Um, and then bonus action, I'll second wind. Uh, instead of attacking her again. So what does second wind do again? I, I don't do I have it written down here? Yeah, I do. Okay. So boom. You have a limited well of stamina that you could draw upon to protect yourself. On your turn, you could use a bonus action or gain hit points equal to one D ten plus your fighter level. Once you use this feature, you must be short. Okay, so one D ten is slash armor one D ten. I did roll. Five plus, plus six. Yeah. So eleven. Nice. Nice. All right. And with that, Sophie, you are up. That was a hit and a half for you. Hmm. What do I want to do? He cut you. I would have hit her with the broad of the blade. I'm probably not actually trying to cut her in or anything. No holds bar, man. There's magic healers. What, what is, is this? this? I cut her. I cut her. She's in the arena. <laughs> she she decided to step in the arena. Well, I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do here. Because I'm kind of in a pickle. You're in a pickle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm, I'm basically one hit, so even mm -hmm. if I fled, Tammy's gonna just kill me anyway. Sky here news that oh, there's Sky an arena battle up. and shows up. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so, I'm gonna do this then. I'm gonna do uh, It's 2v1 chaos. on Sylphie, that's hilarious. <laughs> Actually, this is my only You're chance on sur Do I try to survive, or do I, do I try to... I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna cast uh, Chaos Bolt. Nice with Tides of Chaos, so it's at advantage. So that doubles my chance at a magic roll. And she's going to cast it point blank, so that actually makes it so. Isn't no, wait, no, I have a just, yeah. Is point blank, you're not Battlecaster, are you? No, I'm not Battlecaster. That's, okay. So with Tides Aren't of you... Chaos, I would just remove the disadvantage. It would just be a normal roll. Aren't you a spell slasher or something, Malzahar? Um, I am. I'm waiting for. I'm waiting for her to actually. Yeah, put I can't the thing. change my thing now. I forgot. Yeah. About that. So, so say what you're doing, and then I'm yeah, saying I have what I'm doing. Slayer. <laughs> so I'm gonna tide the chaos it with a chaos bolt right in front of him. So what does that even do? So does the reaction hit before her spell does though? Because she's casting the spell, and you get if you've got a reaction. To make yeah, I would attack. reaction immediately, so I would get the melee uh, attack. Right I have away. to, I have to roll the wild magic though. So whatever happens after that happens after that. Yeah. So if you I roll a two or roll a one, wild magic? if I roll a two or a one, it's wild magic. All right. First, let's see if Mouse hits before we do all that. Oh, okay. Oh, and Nox are unconscious where the wild magic goes nuts. No, it'll happen anyway. But let's see if it hits first. Well, okay. it'd be funny if like I turn into a flower punch <laughs> crushes me. <laughs> Yeah, so let's see. Yeah. Mal's make a melee okay. weapon attack. Okay. 14. That does not meet my DC. Dang. Okay. Okay. Shit. And now you have to make a, what's that, the dex save for the. No, 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 no. Chaos Bolt no, no. is. That's an is, attack. Yeah, it's 13. If I will re. Oh, wait, no. I can't use reposting, can I? No. It's you a can't. reaction as well. Yeah, and okay. you. Yeah, I Mage Slayer. Okay. <laughs> so does that does that hit or not? No, the, no, no. <laughs> no. Okay. I'm a fighter. So now the wild magic. Wild magic time. One or two. Come on, level five fucking thing that destroys uh, me. Ah, nothing. That's not a one or a two, thankfully. Nothing. nothing. Well, All right. I die. <laughs> <laughs> well, wait up, Chris yeah. is invisible, and let's see what he's up to. Okay. Not to meta and let uh, Sylphie live, but I did use my reaction to Mage Slayer. That being said, if you leave my range, technically I, speaking, I didn't. I didn't think of it, so I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna meta okay, it. Fair I enough. was. Yeah, I forgot about that. He's panicking <laughs> in the middle of the fight. Plus, Sylphie <laughs> wouldn't want to leave his range after he willingly came over. <laughs> <laughs> not like I had a choice. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get. I'm probably gonna be rolling on the floor, laughing in front of you, and you're just gonna stick me with something pointy in a second. What is this? What is Chris doing? I gotta figure it out because she's in trouble. I need to figure out the range on command. She's in trouble. She got hit by a level five magic missile. You're the fighter. Oh, now I know where Chris is. Aw, oh, don't. I didn't mean that. I forgot yeah, you guys no could see this. I won't. I won't. I, I, it's not like I would actually know. It's fine. Okay. I, I have it's to measure funny. anyway. That's fine. 80 feet. 
I feel like I'm within range. Everything's almost 120 feet, isn't it, for you? Am I going to get shot by a pistol <laughs> in the back? <laughs> off your armor <laughs> like well maybe I throw it <laughs> <laughs> would that not break the invisibility um, yeah probably if it yes. cast its you have advantage oh I, I, even if he makes an attack yeah if he makes an action like yeah because I it, I couldn't do a, multiple spells that were concentration so yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can't either so I think, yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's concentration. It's concentration. Just give me a second here. I gotta find my things. Okay, so I'm gonna use my action. I'm gonna move more towards the middle. I'm gonna go down more towards the middle. I won't be on the ground quite yet, but. Um, then I'm going to upcast Charm Person so I can target two people. Great. Um, and in the right spot, I might not be able to get both of them. No, I can't reach both of them. They're too far apart. Not 65. One of these spots has got to work. Maybe not. Oh, no, that doesn't work. I got to be somehow in between those two spots. So I don't think I can do this mechanically. So I will do it so once I'm then. Sure. So I'll cast it first level and I will charm person on Mal's. No, this isn't going to work. No, this isn't going to work. Um... So wait, I get advantage on that? You would because we're fighting you, but I have to figure this out, how, yeah. to, how to compile this. Chris, I think that would be useless in general, even like mechanically, thematically. I do hold you as a close acquaintance. We're in the arena. I will still <laughs> beat you, even if you're my friend. Yeah, yeah I don't think charming is going to work whatsoever. It's, I don't think that works here. It stacks with no, another no, ability no, I have. I'm not saying, yeah, I'm not saying, like, he, he has to use it. I'm just, I don't think that'll do anything. I guess we'll see what his plans are. Um, hold on, I gotta read command again. Yeah, yeah, man. I gotta figure out how to do this, because I can't I'm not a fighter. My abilities are not for this. <laughs> boo! Boo! I need to see if I can tell someone to do something harmful. I'm not sure if I can. Not to themselves. Oh, what did Lorianne mention me on Facebook? Probably a cat she wants us to adopt. Okay, so it depends on what the DM says. Okay. So Charm isn't going to do anything. Um, so I have to figure out what I'm going to do with my actual action. Yeah, this is, sorry guys, this is, I am not a fighter. <laughs> there. <laughs> Hideous laughter again? Oh, uh, here we go. Oh, I'll use suggestion. How about that? I will suggest... No, it's a 30-foot range. I can't do both people. Fuck! Wait, I can still move. I'll get close enough to Malzahar, leave some movement. I'm going to argue whatever you suggest. I want you to know that. <laughs> I'm going to fly so that I'm within 30 plausible. feet of you. Okay. Yeah. No, I say. With my 60 feet of movement. Oh, I'm too high, though. Okay, never mind. I'll just do one thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'll <laughs> use suggestion on Malzahar to stop fighting. I don't think that would work. It's magic, man. <laughs> yeah, but... Like, so, one sec, I gotta read suggestion, because if I remember how it works correctly, I don't think this will work. You suggest a course of activity limited to a sense or two, and magically influence the creature to see within range that can hear and understand you. Creatures that can't be charmed are immune to this effect. Uh, actually, I can't, can I? No, I have advantage, because I have fey. It's not I can't be charmed. Uh, suggestion must be worded in a manner as to make the course of action sound reasonable. That's 
what you need to do. You need to word this to make it reasonable because I'm not going to give up in a fight in the arena as a gladiator. Well, just because you can't hit Sylphie. <laughs> okay, then I'm going to hit you. That's fine. Okay. Well, then, yeah, yeah, it's like stop beating on Sylphie or something like that. I yes. can't what I'm saying. Don't hurt your friends. Okay. No, uh, this is the arena. This isn't pain. This is practice. <laughs> Sylvie's got like blood okay. running out on her cheek. And... <laughs> One sec. Do I get a... do I get advantage at this because of Faye? Yeah. And... Okay. Advantage. Yeah, this is straight up yeah. a, a charm. Oh! Ooh! Yeah. After all that, Mal saves. Well, then I I'll use the my bird. bonus action. <laughs> oh no. And I'm gonna use the Mantle of Majesty. So I'm gonna use a bonus action to command cast command without using a spell slot. Um oh, and I'm gonna command you to Um feel the emotions <laughs> or like sad emotions of fighting your friends. This can't make you happy, you have to feel sad. List, list it out because I want to see once again. Like it's similar to because you have to really, realize I'm a gladiator. Command is different though. It's not. So yeah, so that's why I want to read it. That's why I want to read it because I'm pretty yeah. sure it's like it's pretty direct. It's like you have to, but I want him to list it. This is why PvP gets complicated. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, you speak one word command to creature. What's your what's your one word <laughs> before I read this? Feel. <laughs> nah, this isn't gonna work. The target must succeed on wisdom save throw or fall command the next turn. So it has no effect if the target is undead or if it doesn't understand your language or if your command is directly harmful to it. So I guess mental harm would be my argument for the directly harmful. Yeah. Some typical commands and their effects follow you might to command over the one described here. If you do so, the GM determines how target behaves. Okay, so Lauren, this is really up to you anyways. Target moves toward you. Wait, wait. The spell ends. Approach. What target moves towards you by shortest direct ending its turn if it moves within five feet of you? That's what if target. it's halt and stuff. I don't know what's. Oh, if it's like halt. Oh, oh, yeah, those are specific words and examples. Fair. Approach, grovel. Okay, okay. Yeah. To be fair, um... if the target can't. Sorry. If the target can't follow your command, the spell ends. So, again, it's like whether or not. Can you change your emotions on command? Well, I'm gonna a. I'm gonna Magically. let Lauren dictate what the hell feel means. Are you sure your words feel? Like I'm just so so. That's I'm gonna the feel word excited. I use. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to incite feelings of feelings? maybe not harming somebody. Yeah. So essentially, for this, if you pass, you still have to roll. Um, okay. It will be that you are going to feel for your turn. So you're not going to actually want to attack or anything like that. You're just going to be like, oh, man, I feel like so great. Like, it could be elation, but you're going to feel it for yourself. So you're going to okay. pause in combat to feel. Maybe incite the crowd. Why would it not be just like free, sip but or something? Do I have it? Is this a chart? Is this like a charm as well? Do I get advantage again, or is this normal? I think this is just a command, so it's not a charm, but I don't remember. Okay. It doesn't specify. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, it okay then no. So it'll be a normal roll. Yeah. I fail. So you feel the next So on turn. my turn, I will feel. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and with that long-ass <laughs> turn, Tammy, Chris has suddenly become within vision again yeah i come out of the thing like glowing radiant even big mistake and no. i'm gonna hit him with a lightning bolt <laughs> oh for fuck's sake well don't you have to well i guess that's if he yes roll a deck save yeah, yeah i'll take damage no matter what yeah unless you can take like enough that. damage for it to matter though Nope. Take nine damage, bitch. <laughs> oh no. Get zapped again. Are you gonna move it all, Tammy? I like yeah, the crying Chris eye. Out? No, he's like, good. He's cursed out. He's not out. 
I'm gonna drop the spell. Can I drop the drop it and sp sp cast something else this turn? No, only one spell a turn. Bonus. Pardon? If if it, is it a bonus action spell? Yes. Calling the lightning's a full action, yeah. and it uses a spell. No, does it actually use the sp a spell again, or is it just? No, it uses its spell. Okay. You don't Cause, cause expend the spell slot, but it's still but the concentration. concentration is the your your, your, ma your magic is being channeled into that one area is essentially why you can't just suck it back and throw it there. Yeah, you're, you're holding a storm at bay and controlling it. <laughs> That's pretty powerful magic. Um, this is fair, unless uh, it's a bonus action spell. I think it is a bonus. I do have a bonus action spell. Well, can you throw it in? What is it? You can't do it unless it's not a leveled spell. So it has to be a cantrip. Oh, okay. That's the problem with the uh, concentration spells. Like it's they do tie up what you're doing. Right? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. it's nothing to do with the concentration. She used her full action to cast the spell again. Oh. To call lightning. Like, pulling so, yeah, lightning is still oh, the full so you, action. But even if but if she does a bonus action, what I'm saying is it can't be a leveled spell. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Can't yeah, yeah, because it counts as a spell. spell. Still concentrate. Yeah. Oh, all right. Concentration uh, spells are great, but bad. Well, that's just a really, really, really powerful one. Mm. Yeah, yeah lightning's devastating. Yeah, I'm. Well, I'm still staying backed up to the wall. Cool, Malzahar. I. Uh, you're feeling. What are you feeling, though? Is it the cheer of the That's crowd? That's the thing. It's just like, or the pain. I guess I just that you like bask in people? the glory of like. No, no. It's like, are you not entertained? <laughs> are you not entertained? <laughs> this is not what you came for. <laughs> Me and Sophie pass gazes with a very worried look on my face. <laughs> I applaud uh, thee. Inspiration. Sweet. I do a gladiator quote at work. <laughs> Yeah. I, and uh, I will end my turn. I, like, that's all yeah, I get, you right? You inspiration from that. You're feeling very strongly right now. <laughs> <laughs> I promised him if he ever did a gladiator quote, he would get inspiration. <laughs> I just picture him with his hands in the air, spinning around, just oh, loving the moment. <laughs> I don't know about spinning around, necessarily, because I don't know if I'd show my back to Sylphie. But I would definitely be, like, raising my hands in the air, looking to the crowd, like, you know, like, what? I expect cheers. Epic. <laughs> so Sophie's going to use her movement to go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Obviously, right I'll react. Unless you you're take still, the disengage you're action. You're still feeling. No, no. That was for my turn. Oh, that was for your turn. My okay, turn yeah. has ended. I would have taken the disengage action then. Yeah, he's got 100% fucked over in this fight. <laughs> I, I've gotten so fucked over Magic, man. man. You're the fighter, man. Magic. What else are we going to do? Let know, you beat us to death? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Let me hit you in the face! I guess, yeah, I guess I have to take the disengage action. So, uh, if I, well, you I can, can also still just move. Risk. You could risk doing the mage armor or, like, a spell again and see if I hit you with reaction and then, did, like, just leave if I react and it fucks up again. Plus, you get your wild surge, maybe. No, I'm going to get my wild surge even with disengage. Well, I'll try to get it. Uh, I'm disappointed well, in you, Sylphie, running away. 10, 15, 20. Do, wait, do you say that in character? Yes. Okay, Sylphie doesn't run away. <laughs> she is the going to work. In her, she's bleeding. She's about to go down. And she's going to misty step into your arms. And try to wait, get what? a wild magic surge. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll 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 mage slayer yes. this, obviously, in reaction. She's teleporting, you wouldn't get a reaction. Yeah, no, you did so. wait, mage, mage, mage passed slayer... it within five feet of me. Yeah, that that mage slayer would still get it, I think. Yeah, I think yeah. so actually, because she casts yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Like As you're casting channel duration, <laughs> yeah. Slaps you. Alright, make your attack. Alright. Because maybe she just skewers herself whammies, on whammies, your whammies. sword as she steps into you. Twenty? Oh, she... yeah, that, that that'll hit. But we'll see what happens with wild magic. Nice. So okay. four. Well, I am gonna. Uh, is it yet? 
polymorph me into Should a T Rex. Four or no? Four or lower, <laughs> and it's wild magic. No. Yes. <laughs> okay. So you lost the I am gonna add. I am gonna add. Obviously, a uh, what's it? A combat superiority die. So, but so the damage Anyone is. Any action? It, yeah, I can add it to any of my attacks. That's crazy. crazy. Nice. Well, that's what. That's the only reason Battlemaster is halfway decent. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I use another one. Uh, so it'll do another one d eight, and it's just gonna be menacing strike again. So slash r one d eight for another seven. So thirteen damage. And if you're still up. She's I've got three health. I'm dead. Yeah, she's like you're just beating my, my crumpled corpse. <laughs> Good. The magic missiles hurt something. I thought we had something special. She's like she's just dying. She's like, <laughs> All right. And then uh, let's see. Let's get in range of Chris, range shall we? And wait, that was my first attack that- Oh, no, no. That was a Remember, reaction. I don't get to move. This yeah, yeah a that was a reaction. reaction. <laughs> Calm down. What am I doing? Okay. It is Chris's Woo! turn. And I am going to slip into the invisibility again. Oh, God. <laughs> Does the fly go away? Uh, no, because it's wild magic. It has no yeah. effect on me. Well, how long does it last? Ten minutes? Or one minute? Uh, I don't have the spell. Both of those are really long. <laughs> Yeah, uh, that's a lot of rounds, but it's, it's the, it's the fly spell. Like a, it's, it's the fly spell. Like so hundred rounds. It would be it would be uh, ten minutes. Okay, so he's basically the whole, the whole fight. He's gonna be fine. Yeah, he's fine. Beautiful, and he's invisible. <laughs> yes, I start. Wait, no, it. no. It specifies that I cast it, so no, he falls out of the sky. At that well, because oh, it would be called. Oh, he falls! <laughs> How high was he? That's I a, think that's a short creature. Yeah, oh, I'm gonna take damage for sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you just get knocked out. Okay. Yeah, I just I just checked. Cause you were uh, sixty feet in the air. Oh right? yeah, was he? No, I was pretty close to ground. I think I was no, I was like twenty feet, but it's two D six for twenty feet. Oh, because you had to come low to hit Malice's yeah. Six damage. Then I hit the ground as a limp body. <laughs> <laughs> Two birds, one stone. <laughs> what up? I thought, yeah, I thought it was just like a oh. random effect. No, it, it specified that I casted it. You know, as the final body hits the ground, the crowd goes wild. I, I check Sylphie, like, like I try to wake her up because I assume like the magical means she didn't die. She might just be like, you know, incapacitated of sorts. Like the first hit knocked her to the ground. She was like bleeding, and you're like, now I'm gonna do all this extra stuff on top of it. <laughs> Twist the blade a little bit in her chest. Yeah. yeah. You just kept saying and. I'm like, she's dead already, man. Oh, no, no, no. And. <laughs> and, I... and then? And, and then I do it again. Oh, and then? <laughs> More attacks. Okay, I'm not going to lie. If I had lost this fight in the arena, I was I was going to be a little sad. I would have been yeah. a little sad. Gladiator <laughs> losing in the arena. No. Yeah. That would have been ultimate bragging rights, though. <laughs> I, oh, yeah. I'd oh, never yeah. let it down. <laughs> I, I'm pretty okay. sure Mal's hard be done as a character. <laughs> 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 so disheartened. First time you ever got hit. Walk over, I guess, and see how they're all doing. Wait, so this is the first time Amizan beat the crap out of Sylvia the same way. So she's just, she's gonna get a reputation for just getting overly beaten once she falls to the ground. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so I think yeah, I'm just gonna do a bit of showing off here, and yeah, just like all right, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead, do it. I like it, victory. <laughs> it's amazing. She's music. gonna pop out. Goes wild. Do I see Sky? Do I see Sky? Because I'm like walking around the arena, raising my hands, looking to the crowd now. After I'm like, Sylvie's okay. Let's rock around and enjoy the adoration. Do I see Sky? Yep. Sweet. Oh, Sky's very happy to see you. you. Stop! <laughs> hey! Hey, buddy! Uh, I would like to point out that uh, Sky and Kip were both sitting in the audience watching you guys, and Sky bet money on Malzahar. 
<laughs> Yay! Did you did you whisper to the Lord and everything? No. No, um, I just dropped that in your mouth. You so should no have that money on me, man. Yeah. We all should have. We could have rigged it. <laughs> <laughs> Chris would do that. Sophie would do that. Yeah, not so much, Chris. That's true. I bet. I you bet you'd win, though. No, but that's what I mean. I feel like the win would have been hollow. I feel like you guys would have just thrown it. It would have gone pretty much like this. <laughs> I wasn't winning this. It didn't matter who was on my team. <laughs> Dude, you you scared the shit. Wait, what if I was on on your team? We would have lost. <laughs> I don't know. I, I can't do anything. It would have been all up to you. I would have directed you as the battle master. Go over there. I'd be like, all right, walk. <laughs> I, <prefer. laughs> I wanted, I wanted so badly for my last one to trigger the, uh, In the, the wild though. magic. Like yeah. if I, I go into your arms and then it triggers the cast fireball on yourself. Oh my god! <laughs> the suicide takeout. Yeah. yeah. Predator uh, tactics. <laughs> <laughs> but either it, way, it's Chris would have fallen. Yeah, yeah, Tammy. Yeah. Is it okay if Tammy's just like, hey, give it up, we all did a good job, and she's gonna walk over and healing word, uh, Chris, and then she's gonna walk over and healing, and, uh, do that again for Delphi, and like, hey, you guys did great. Lifts their arms up, woo, and they're like limp. <laughs> did we win? <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting them back up. Tammy, I'm dying. <laughs> Do we make anything off this fight from like the arena like coordinator? Sure. Sweet. I think that's nice. actually one of my gladiator perks is just anywhere I go, I'm able to is it this? No. Uh... The winners make seventy six and the losers make thirteen gold. Nice. Each. Nice. 76 gold. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, oh, thanks, Al. <laughs> <laughs> As they heal you up, they pass you a little baggie of gold. Nice. And that is where we'll end it tonight. Good job, everybody. Nice. Good job, guys. <laughs> My favorite part was the Are You Not Entertained? I love that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You told me to feel. <laughs> it was great as soon as we figured out what to do with my turn <laughs> also sorry to be a dick about a lot of the charm stuff but i hate the charm stuff and like if you're gonna tell me like stop fighting in the arena as a gladiator <laughs> yeah that's yeah. Yeah. yeah it's magic know. man magic, magic is, is so against his character though yeah it would have been advantage anyway because because i could tell him to shit himself and he would have <laughs> yeah. to do it <laughs> no way Oh yeah. No oh yeah. Like my yeah. dignity. If I'm a proud person, that's actually one of my traits. I'm proud slash arrogant. As long I mean, as it doesn't hurt you. <laughs> it hurts my reputation. Unfortunately, it feels is, is is not a bad thing. It could have been so yeah, much no, worse. I, I could have been like, get naked. Yeah, we could have gotten naked for No, something. that's not one word. That's not one word. Naked. <laughs> naked. What does that mean? <laughs> I start they stripping spend my your armor turn. keep my twin blade. I'll fight. I'll fight without armor. I don't care. Take 10 minutes to take all my shit off. Yeah, yeah. that would waste your turn anyway. <laughs> for the yeah. first six well, no, seconds, you undo your glove. I'm donning armor <laughs> takes a long time. Well, what do you yeah, wear? Yeah, 15 minutes. Do you have half I wear, like, leather oh. armor. Or no, I wear, like, plate, yeah. I wear, or chainmail? I wear chainmail, yeah. I think. Oh, yeah. I think I wanted a half plate, but it didn't like work the same way that I thought it did, so I think I have chainmail. Have you seen people sure. take chainmail off where they lean forward and like shimmy and it just like falls off them? Yeah. <laughs> and I like, probably have like, a shirt over it too, right? So I gotta take the shirt off. I have to like sh get somehow get this chainmail off. And also it might not be like a full shirt, right? It could be like uh, held up by like latches. It's just a ruse to get your first three buttons undone. <laughs> uh, Adam, you missed it. Sky or Sky. Sophie was invisible and was going around as a backpack. Oh shit! <laughs> she drew yeah, face on happened. her backpack. It was it's a good. It was it's a good thing Sky was there because I yelled in Norfin. 
<laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, she. Oh yeah, she. She. Uh, she stole an orphan's backpack. It was my merchandise. Oh. I didn't steal any. We returned it. Was it. The orphan's and I, I don't yeah, know if the only thing in that backpack was the shirts though. They're orphans. Like, did we what ever actually look have? in the bag? <laughs> 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 Their lunch? I don't know. Seriously yeah. though, GG everyone. Chris, damn your magic. Sylphie, what the fuck? <laughs> you, my my magic is so you. useless for fighting. And, and Mal, disagree. thank you for tanking that. So how did this come about? Like, like how did you guys end up fighting each other? Mouse was gonna go yeah. training with this person, but instead we just went to the arena to fight each other. <laughs> well, yeah. We're convinced to practice yeah. fighting. Yeah, everybody thought it would be hilarious. Uh, and and gotta get beat down by me! <laughs> what up? It was the lightning. <laughs> yeah, the lightning yeah, was... Oh my god, my... oh my god, Tammy, how did we not come up with the you bring the lightning, I'll bring the thunder! <laughs> is that that's our that's our team name now lightning and th thunder or thunder and lightning that's it there the we go. thundercats Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. that could be our full team right. name that could be our full team name maybe and now i'm imagining mouths with neko cat ears <laughs> <laughs> and like a little fake tail <laughs> that's now paraphernalia sold at the arena <laughs> I'm no longer Crimson Sand, I'm Crimson Kitty. <laughs> Can you change your name on stream to that? No. Crimson Kitty! Crimson Kitty! Crimson Kitty! I've been practicing an uwu voice. Oh, uwu! Uwu! I, I assume we're in post-game now discussing... Yeah, the, uh, we're done. Session? Okay. We're hanging out. I could... Yeah, I can hang up for probably like 10, 15, and then I gotta go. Where are you gonna go, Woo? <laughs> <No. Yeah. laughs> the cringe is too strong. It hurts my soul. Um, she did it for like a whole day straight. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta practice. Oh my god. I can only imagine you sitting there, like you're playing like New World, beating down on people, and then oh, you just woo. hear like, <laughs> Oh no, there's 36 damage hit, Woo? Woo? <laughs> I was like, I don't even know what it is, so I'm just gonna say a woo oh after every God. sentence. And he was like, "That's essentially it." No. And blame TikTok. I saw a girl like, "You've seen a woo girls? Have you seen a woo DMs?" And then she like changes clothes. <laughs> oh God. The so sixteen meets your AC, woo. -woo. Oh God. <laughs> and we also changed what the sewer is gonna look like next session. I wish I actually got a level. <laughs> a fourth level spell spell would have been awesome. Oh, oh my god, what what are you gonna do? Did you not level up? No. No, no. It was just to just trigger you guys to actually answer, answer the question. question. Yeah. She yeah. hurt my feelings. It worked. She I tricked me. We, except for Tammy and Silky. What's that? You get experience for the arena. Wait, what I what you I missed? A thousand experience. Is that level? Am I leveling? Am I, I getting know. a level? No, you're not. <laughs> we oh, haven't received it. experience is not nearly enough. No, <laughs> you're getting a thousand experience. Um, I'd also I'd asked everybody to do a Myers Briggs. Oh, I forgot to do that. Sorry. Yeah, personality test for their character. Everybody's was pretty cool so far. Oh shit. But Sorry. That's okay. It's just it, yeah, gets you in your character's mood. Everybody's was funny. It was good insight. <laughs> Chris. You still want me to do that? Sure. Yeah, 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 I'm ready. Yeah, I'll, I'll get it to you this week. Nice. Did Did this inspire you at all, Chris? To learn how to fight, yeah. <laughs> getting my <laughs> ass kicked. The showmanship of the arena. <laughs> well, the roar of the crowd, <laughs> the 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 awe. Of that was scary, landscape. man. Like, they were all like yelling, "Murder her! Murder her!" I, I also love the lightning storms and Sophie absorbing them is like super in character for That's her backstory. And it's really cool. That is really cool. That is it was pretty cool. cool. Yeah. That you have that. Yeah. I wish I could do that. I need, oh, I need a gap close. That's like my biggest weakness. A gap close? Oh, between, oh, between the magic casters and like... Yeah, yeah we, we were like 70 like, feet away from them. started at the wall of the arena. We were 10 feet was, from like, it. <laughs> Yeah, you definitely need to figure out some either like range weapons. You were thirty feet from your edge. 
I can't believe that me stepping back five feet screwed over your spell, Chris. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. I was going to suggest one and and try to charm the other or command the other. Cause it's just to stop you Actually, both for a round. Had you suggested something like disarm or something like that, I would have probably tried to... Sure, yeah, I'll beat you guys with my fist. I would have probably, well, actually, yeah, yeah, I would have done it. Yeah, you would. I would have said yes to that. I would have tried grovel, but I preferred to do something more Chris would do. It should be like, stop, slow down, feel it. <laughs> don't let this go to your head. You don't want to do this sort of thing. Yeah, it was a good battle. Um, I'll prep a bunch of monsters for next time, because I feel like as a team, you guys will just go <laughs> ham. And... Nice. Oh yeah, yeah. Like prep, like st I'd say stuff will monsters lose. Prep a lot of stuff will lose. Oh, yeah. yeah, I I've been like I have a bunch saved and stuff, and I'm slowly building them. But the ones I have ready are for like a one v one or not yet a whole group. I fought in the arena. Now Malzahar has to perform on stage. <laughs> and go to Dolores's. No, yeah, we're gonna go to Dolores's. Actually, we should celebrate next session. We'll go to Dolores's after this. Okay. And then during the Thieves Guild run, I'll be high as shit. <laughs> I'll write that down. Do you guys want to start next session going to Dolores's? I don't mind. Sylvie can definitely sure? not go to the Thieves Guild tonight because she has no spells left. <laughs> well, you guys are going to take a nap, rest. right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sylvie's taking an involuntary long rest right now. <laughs> <laughs> I assume Tammy and Chris are also pretty tired. The only one who got a relatively good sleep is like Sky and Mal's. I honestly so. didn't use that many spells. <laughs> We said we got like a full rest in between sessions or something, but it was because you guys got woken up by the crowd early in the morning. It would have only been like a short rest, but it's fine to actually take it. And... Uh, okay. But it, it would have been have... short or full because we would have been resting while we had breakfast and walked around town all the <laughs> way up till we started fighting. So that's why, that's why it was fine to take it, but it's still like you guys are tired. It was still like six hours or four hours of sleep. So going to sleep again before the thieves run wouldn't be uncharacteristic is what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah, it was noisy. You didn't have sleep, but you still had the sleep. The rest. We did have a long rest, but not like a sleep one. So we still worried about exhaustion points, you mean? or? I guess that would make sense. It's just like it more RP wise. Like it would make sense if you guys wanted to go to bed. I won't yeah, take anything. Probably gonna do that. that. Yeah. To be all on, because most sleep is good. My spells are okay, but my I'm not happy at half health. <laughs> yeah, everybody got really good demolished that round. Like, well, I think like, they healed us up, right? So we'd be full health, but yeah, yeah. they might not recover yeah. our spells. But I'm but saying, I'm, oh, okay. Right. Everybody, that's good. Yeah, Every, everybody took a lot of damage from everybody. It wasn't so yeah, seriously. Sophie's gonna get in trouble by Miss Joy. She just fought in front of the city. <laughs> well, only if she hears about it. Oh, she definitely heard about it. Ooh. Right. She was there. <laughs> yeah. Just like wagging her finger slowly back and forth in the middle of the crowd. <laughs> Sylvie, Sylvie, Sylvie. <laughs> you didn't oh, even I win. <laughs> I say, no fighting. <laughs> I can't wait to see how this affects character interactions, though. <laughs> yeah, you guys got to beat the shit out of each other. Hopefully that got some frustrations out. I dealt no damage. <laughs> Ouch. Why do you deal no damage? Like, I, I play music! A lot of CC. <laughs> yeah, but, but don't you have, like, vicious mockery and, like, some bardic stuff that you can do? Yeah, but it, do I want to take a damn a full action to maybe do one d four damage? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, but I feel like you're missing out on the opportunity to roast us like all the time or roast enemies. I feel like a vicious is vicious mockery a bonus action? Oh, no, it's a full action. action. Yeah, no, it's, yeah. a, it's a cantrip. Yeah. yeah, there are so bonus, bonus action cantrips. Action cantrip would be crazy, but yeah, but wait, which ones? Well, like, well, like even, even 1d4. It's like light and stuff like that. Ah, uh, okay. Well, like Mio Mio and her rage, like my Storm Aura is a bonus action 1d4 lightning. Like, it would have been well, easy to make Vicious Mockery. I don't think there's any damaging ones. No. Well, Vicious Mockery, the other benefit is, and this would have probably been helpful, my next attack is at disadvantage. Yeah. 
That's if you fail. That's if I fail. Keep in mind, because these are all wisdom saves, right? Or is it charisma? I, wisdom. That's... I'm negative one wisdom. Yeah, but then I would get struck by lightning repetitively. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you probably should have tried to break your concentration, I guess. Oh yeah, take even that, yeah, might have been nice to just break your concentration with it. Uh Matt, you gotta figure out what your spell save DC is for those. Yeah, it's I feel like it's thirteen. You can write it like, like your nose. Right? No. It's eight eight plus uh, I don't know if you can do Dex for your Battlemaster no, DC. No, I don't think it's I don't think it's Dex. I think it's uh, or is it? I don't freaking know. It should know. be in Google or on the description somewhere. Like, yeah, I'll look it up. I'll add it to the called? spell thing. It should uh, be it's distracting strike or no yeah. menacing strike. The DC should be eight plus your strength plus your proficiency. But I know your okay. Dex space, so you might be able to use Dex, but I don't know. I don't think I can. I think it's still strength. If I can use dex, that's great. I think it makes sense, but I, I don't know the ruling. I think you should just let him use dex, Lori. He's That's how he fights. He's tripping and stuff like that. Maybe that's why it's strength, because shove and stuff. Maybe it's situational. I don't know. Because it's frightened of you. I don't know, it doesn't say. That's stupid. That's the thing, yeah. I don't know what the DC is. It should say like, like, somewhere like, where your maneuvers... One sec, let's see. So, uh... Battle Master DC. Let's just look up Battle Master DC. Battle Master D&D 5e. It'll probably just say what it is, right? Should. Um, maneuver save DC. 8 plus your proficiency bonus plus your strength or dex mod. Okay. Or dex mod. Yeah. Okay, sweet. There we so, go. Woo. So, 8 plus four plus three nice that's pretty good so that's 15. yeah that's on par with some of our spell seeds which makes sense because you're perfectly statted into your decks so and right now i put decks as my spell casting it's in my spell casting thing now i just i had to set it won't let me write it in manually i have to set my spell casting ability which is decks i put in here and then so now yeah spell save dc 15. So Wait. there we go. So how do we feel about tonight's session? Any improvements? Any disagreements? I like my, it. my back. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Sylvie, your wild magic. She <laughs> so triggered that oh, so many God. times. That was a lot. That was you've only ever triggered it like once before. MVP. Wild and they were magic. all good for Cause her. It's because like I we're never really like in a long term combat like that. So I like I used all my spell slots. So I was just getting constant <laughs> rolls on it. Yeah, that's yeah. True. Yeah, you didn't have to watch out. You were like, I'm going down. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. The re reactions. On trips, or is it only on spells? It's it's any casted spell. The reaction spell triggering it is it was crazy. They doubled your chances with absorbing the elements. I love yeah. that. That's, but, that yeah, we also yeah. We uh we also use the like the reason it was because normally like according to the handbook it only activates on one but we have it set up so that every time I use a spell slot, it uh it increases the chance by that spell slot's level. So like say I used level one spell it would increase from one to two and it adds up until it uh, until it uh goes off. Yeah. And then it doubles if she uses the uh. Yeah, tied the chaos. Yeah, it ties the chaos. Hey right, guys, I got a dip. Okay, good Great session. session. Everybody, yeah, fantastic. Bye. Session. Have a good one, dude. All right, bye See guys. Everybody. Bye. Take care, guys. Have bye. A great